Hello, hello everybody, hello Magic, how's it going? Hi, I'm here, but home and playing DVD, it sounds good, well I'm glad you're, are you home because it's a holiday? Because I really hope you're home because it's a holiday, I hope it's nothing else. But, hello Magic, I hope you're having fun in DVD today, oh I could probably switch screens, right? That would be very polite of me to not stay on this chatting screen. <laughs> But hello, I hope everyone had a wonderful weekend in Magic. Have the best of time in DBD today. Hopefully it's a good day in the fog. Reuse? Am I saying that right? Hello, how's it going? Welcome on in. Welcome to Skelly Town. I hope you're all having a great day. I hope you're all having a lovely weekend or had a lovely weekend. If you're in the United States, happy whatever holiday it is. <laughs> and if you're in Canada, happy Thanksgiving to all of you. Um, we're going to be playing DVD today because that's, that's what I do. I had a really bad migraine today, so I stayed home. Okay, well, I'm so sorry you had a bad migraine that you had to stay home. I was hoping you were home because it was a holiday because that's much better than having a really bad migraine. I'm so sorry you had a migraine or have had. Hopefully it's a had migraine. Hopefully it's all gone, and you're feeling so much better, Magic. Hi, SK! And your cute penguin emotes! <laughs> How are you? Well, I'm sorry to hear that, Magic. I hope you're feeling much, much, much better. And getting in a lot of good DVD games. Because today is the 10th, so that means... Rank Reset is right around the corner, which means you never know what you're gonna get in the fog. Usually rank reset, right before rank reset, you can get a lot of, I like to just put it, interesting people out there, but also you can sometimes have great games. Hi, Maria! How are you? How was, how was everyone's weekend? I hope you all had a wonderful weekend. That's freaking cute. Oh, that's bees! Okay, yeah, I've seen that one in Magic's chat. I love those emotes. Those are some really good ones. <laughs> Because they all have, like, the spoopy vibe to them, and I love it. If you have spoopy uh, emotes, like, either a scary movie or just a vibe like that, I love them. They're just always so amazing, because y'all know me and my spoopy vibes, right? I, You know what? I, I have all my emotes, and I love them. I do need to rework some, but I think whenever I do rework them eventually, I might put more, like, of a spoopy panda into them. You know what I mean? We all like the spoopy here, and I'm all about it. So I need to, like, work into more spoopy and this into my emotes. I think only one has kind of a spoopy feel to it, and that is my, um, sip emote. Because she's, uh, well, she, the panda, is drinking out of a pumpkin mug. <gasps> you have boobies! <laughs> I love it! Hello, Denny. How are you? How have you been, Denny? Is everything go getting better? Doing good? I love the boobies. I'm alright. How are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing really good. I'm ready for stream today. Every time I have to take off Friday, I always get, like, super excited. Or, not that I'm always not always excited, but I get even more excited to stream on Mondays. Because usually, like, on Sunday, I'm sitting at my computer, like, kind of lurking and doing stuff. And I'm like, I really want to stream right now. <laughs> and I usually try not to, just to the fact where I'll be live the next day. It's okay. I'll be back. But every time I have Fridays off, I always have, like, get extra anxious around, like, Sunday afternoon that I really just want to be streaming. Or mainly, like, just hanging out. You know what I mean? But yesterday, I ended up doing a rework on something I have coming up in the new year. Because um, y'all know me when it comes to doing stuff for stream, like when it comes to designs or even my V2 character. I freaking love to play around and change things. And so when the new year rolls around, I have a complete rework coming up, like of streams. Meaning I'll have a different look going. You know, the one we have now is two years old, which is, I love it still. It's amazing. But I have a complete rework coming up um, in the new year. And... I think I've changed the look like six times since I've started working on it. Because <laughs> every time I work on it, I always think of something else I want to do or a completely different design I want to do. So I have like, I'm glad I gave myself months in advance to work on it because I've changed a couple things like a hundred times, I swear. 
better somewhat not feeling too good right now though oh no you're telling me getting giving you issues today denny i'm sorry and then nausea i'm so sorry well i'm glad you're doing better somewhat that's always a good sign it's not getting worse that's always the positive as long as it's getting better somewhat but i hope you do feel better too denny i hope your tummy and the nausea goes away if you need to sit back and relax i completely 100 percent understand i know i know i know always remember everybody you come first always remember that i always say that and then i don't do it for myself but that's just human nature i think <laughs> i never do it for myself but this weekend i did I told you guys I was going to try and stream on Saturday. So if you guys aren't in my Discord, I put this in the announcement section. Um, I'm a person who has to have a schedule. Like, I don't know why I'm like this, but if I get off of my schedule, I feel completely messed up. And then I like, I kind of not sound weird, but I get like in a bad mood, I guess you could say, because I'm kind of all messed up. So I like to have a schedule. Because when I came back last year, I even said, I will not have a schedule. I will stream when I want to. And when I started doing that, I started feeling like, I don't know like it was rough like not having the schedule set that's why I have like my schedule set to like DVD on these days variety on these days because I just need that to feel better to feel more comfortable and all that it's just who I am so I didn't stream Friday because I wasn't home and so I was gonna stream Saturday to make up for it believe me I woke up with every intention of doing it but as I kind of sat at my computer knowing like I normally don't stream on this day I just kept getting into my head like I just didn't feel like it anymore you know what I mean like I kept sitting there like mm, no, I'm just not feeling it just not feeling it so I decided though and like I said I wrote this in the discord so I'm sorry if this is a repeat but for those of you who are not in discord this is a let you know um, I think I'm gonna switch my Friday streams to Saturday because I do have to be gone on Fridays every couple weeks because I have to take mama to her appointment mama comes first so I have to take her unless like it gets canceled or something but um but I think I'm gonna switch to Saturdays because I used to have we used to have guests come over on Saturdays now they're coming over on Sundays I don't know if they're gonna change their minds and I'm, then it's gonna screw me up but maybe I'll try and power through them being here the only reason I don't is because the dogs get anxious lots of noise in the background but um I might be able to handle it but that will come at a later time but I think I'm gonna switch my days to Saturday but first, I think I'm going to test it. Um, I, I'm, I'm not going to do it this week, and I'll tell you why in a minute. But um, I think I'm going to test streaming on Saturdays instead of Fridays to see if it works and how I like it. And also, I've been thinking, this isn't set in stone yet, but I'm thinking I might switch variety to Monday. Because nothing happens usually with DVD on Mondays. Like nothing. Like maybe a rank reset might happen on the weekend. That's like the only thing that happens, but nothing happens really on the weekend or like exciting on Mondays. So I might switch my variety to Monday, Wednesday, lots of things happen on Wednesday for DBD. So that's, we'll never probably not play DBD on Wednesday. And the reason why I won't switch to Saturday this week is because the Dead by Daylight Halloween event goes uh, into effect on Thursday and I don't want to miss it. Meaning, I don't want to wait that long, so we're going to be streaming on Friday because I want to play in the DVD Halloween event on Friday. So there'll be no variety game again. Sorry, October I said we'll have a lot of spoopy games. Probably won't happen because I won't get around to them. But the Halloween event for DVD goes, it turns on, it starts on Thursday, and I want to play it on Friday. So that is what we'll be doing Friday, and we won't play on Saturday because I like to take at least one time a two-day break somewhere. Uh, I know, but it's been like this for a few days. Whenever I try and eat normal food, my body goes out of whack. Been like this, oh no, for most of the week. I'm so sorry. Has it been like, did you say like normal food? Are you are you eating like certain foods? Because I remember you said you were trying, uh, oh, what was it? Was it dairy free or something? Because you were struggling? Or was it gluten? It was gluten or dairy, I remember. However, bread works fine in cereal. Okay, so it's not gluten. Never mind. <laughs> However, bread works fine in cereal, but when I eat normal food, that's so weird. That really sucks, too. Well, I hope whatever it is, like, you can figure it out and, like, dairy-free. Okay, that's what I, th I thought it was dairy-free, but 
I couldn't completely remember because you all know my brain. It's just non-existent sometimes. I try my best to remember things and it doesn't happen. Like the other day I went out to my living room and I said something to my mom. I was like, well, you know, why is this like this? And she's like, it's been like that for a week. And I'm like, what? No way. That's probably unobservancy though. But I didn't even remember. <laughs> but I'm so sorry. Today. I hope whatever it is, you can figure it out though. I get back to normal and you start feeling better because I don't like hearing when people aren't feeling good. One way or another, I don't like hearing about it. I want you guys to feel always feel good and be living your best lives. But I hope whatever it is, it, you figure it out and it goes away very soon, Denny, and feel much, much, much better. I just sucked an ice cube out of my glass. Mm, sorry. I was trying to drink my drink and an ice cube came out. That wasn't supposed to happen. <laughs> but, yeah, I hope you feel better. I can't keep eating bread. No, you, well, you could. But I understand that you can't. Because, <laughs> yeah, I understand that. I can't just keep eating bread and cereal, no. One, that'd get boring. Two, you need a variety of stuff. I'm going to end up with a severe vi- And, yeah, I was just going to say, and then you're going to have a deficiency in other things was my next thing. Yeah, you, you need other things to keep going. You can't live off just those two things, unfortunately. Because, you know, our bodies, they weird like that. They need attention. Our bodies are so needy. <laughs> our bodies are such needy, needy things sometimes. Well, again, I hope you figure out what it is. And that you can get different, uh, like different foods and different things in your body. So you can get those vitamins and all those good nutritions and everything. Because, yes, your body needs it to be 100% healthy. I wish I could figure out what would be causing that, though. Because I'm just like one of those people. I like to try and figure out what the problem is. Because when my brother was having issues as well a while back, we, we were both trying to figure out, like, what is he doing that's causing this issue, you know, and everything. And we kind of think we figured it out to be possibly a lactose thing. He can still eat a little bit of lactose, like he can eat cheese and things like that. But when he has too much, he has some issues. And we kind of boiled it down to that. And then I don't think he's really had any issues since. I think he have, does every once in a while, but he might get a little bit too much lactose intake at times. Because he's not like super careful. Like I said, he eats cheese and stuff, but he does have lactose free milk and things like that. Hi, I'm new in here. Greetings from Argentina. Well, hello, Ryu. Welcome on in. Thank you so much for hanging out. Welcome on into Skellytown and from Argentina, too. Uh, same for me. I'm not part, but I don't eat a lot of lactose. And that's the same thing with my brother. He doesn't either because he's, ha he's had issues in the past. And it's the same with his caffeine intake. Uh, it was like it's a long time ago now, but he used to have severe problems. And mainly it was like panic attacks and... Um, anxiety from too much caffeine and I you wouldn't really say well I guess it could be anxiety or whatever but he's never had him since he's eliminated um, caffeine from his diet like he does not drink anything caffeine and he hates it because he loves a lot of different caffeinated things he's kind of gotten used to it now but um, a long time ago he had to figure he kind of figured it out on his own because we kept taking him to doctors and they kept just thinking he was you know, having issues in other ways. Like, he took psychological tests and stuff, and nothing ever boiled down to it. But he eliminated caffeine from his diet. Never had that problem again. Never had that problem again. So, he figured it out on his own, no thanks to doctors. But I understand why doctors would look into that. I mean, panic attacks, anxiety, things like that. So. I don't know why I can't follow your channel. Is it not letting you? Is Twitch doing that again? The funny thing is, somebody came into my channel last week. I think it was last week or a week or two ago. I lose track of time. But anyways, um, recently and said they had a problem like that too. Um, on their channel specifically that they were having people tell them like they can't follow their channel. I think it's a Twitch issue. But that's so funny because somebody told me that last week that they were having that issue as well. So I don't know. I don't know, I think it's a Twitch thing. I haven't noticed it ever on my end with trying to follow people, but I have heard people tell me that either it's on their channel, or I, don't, I haven't heard anyone say it on my channel yet, but that their channel, they had people saying that they couldn't follow. 
Like, Twitch wasn't letting him. Might be high amounts of fat in the food. It can cause issues. That is true. That can cause issues, too. The funny thing about food is... It could boil down to so many different things because food has so many different things in it, you know? And it's, it's all always about, like, eliminating and substituting and trying to figure out what it is. You know what I mean? Or, like, if you're being bothered by something. Because that's what we did with my brother. When he was having that issue, we were trying to, like, eliminate certain things at times and see if it would help. And then it would help or didn't help. So we would put that back in the diet, try something else, and... It's like, it's such a trial and error unless you actually get lucky and, and you kind of feel more confident, you know what it is. And you get it on your first try, I guess you could say. Try using a different browser. Firefox is giving you hell with Twitch, but it's working fine on Chrome. There you go. Try a different browser. Even try mobile. If you have it on mobile, that's also, I mean, I hate mobile. Their mobile app kind of sucks, to be honest. But yeah. If you're ever having any issue with Twitch, always either try a different browser or even switch to mobile really quickly and see if mobile um, helps as well. Because I've had that problem where something on mobile doesn't work, but you go over to Twitch, or excuse me, on my browser online, it works there. And then vice versa, it doesn't work on my browser, go over to my online, or my app works there. You chose chaos today! Why? Should I be scared? Oh, so today I saw all the stuff and money from the Auto Havens map. <laughs> you saw all the stuff and the money from the Auto Haven map. Magic. You did choose violence. You did. Or not violence. Chaos. Excuse me. Not violence. Chaos. I was getting prepared to be scared here. I was like, oh no, what is magic going to do now? What is she going to do to me? Oh, excuse me. Hiccup. Ah. <sighs> Yup, it's all mine. <laughs> you know what? It's right before rank reset, Magic. Go for it. Have the best time. I saw a cup of coffee for Magic. <laughs> nice. Oh, also look at my name on Steam. Ooh, okay. Just a minute. Just a minute. Steam, where are you? There you are, Steam. Friends. Friends. Not for buddy kisses? <laughs> oh, that's so cute! I like! Not for bunny kisses. Oh my gosh. I like it. I like it. I was gonna say something and then I lost my train of thought. <laughs> but it's okay. <laughs> Y'all know I love to lose my train of thought. You don't want to look at mine. I, 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 I think I saw yours. Let me go. Let me look. Let me make sure I got it right, though. Yep. <laughs> I did see it. <laughs> I thought I did because it's in my friends list right now. You're right above magic. Yup, I'm going to kiss all the killers. Go for it. Go for it. You know what? Killers, sometimes they need it. They sometimes need that extra love. They might be having a bad day. Or, they just might need some chaos in their life as well. <laughs> I was, so today, I, I decided I'm not going to play killer probably today. I might here and there. I'm going to kind of decide on the fly. Mainly because usually right before rank reset, you get some interesting games. Because it's right before rank reset. But at the same time, I want to rank up my survivor. I have like gold three and I want to see if we can hit eerie within the next two days. At least eerie four. But that is my decision at the moment. I don't know if I'm going to keep that decision. Might go here and there. But I've noticed every time I try and play killer right before rank reset, I don't have a lots of fun. Because you start getting sweaty, people. And I was watching someone stream this morning who plays killer on Mondays. And she, like, she's a very positive person. Like, doesn't bother her. But she's got a lot of interesting characters. So I'm just going to put it that way. I'm not going to say toxic. I'll just say interesting. Because that's kind of what it was. But that is what we're going to do today. We're going to play Survivor and see if I can get my rank up. And then also, if I feel like switching over to Killer for some reason, we will. Or if you guys also redeem it, we can also do that. Yes, <laughs> you are. You are above magic. <laughs> you already got one from Wesker. Nice. Well, I hope all the killers, like, see your name and then do as the name says. Because I like that. I love that. 
Y'all, y'all, y'all gotta have fun in this game. You know, we preach it here. Just have fun, it's a game! Have fun, do your thing! Enjoy your time in the fog! And also gave one to SK for free! <laughs> well, that's a fun thing. You give it to your friends for free, right? Right? And now I'll give one to a voice wombat. Is that their name? Is that their name? You guys like the station today? Alternative. That's what a charged match. I didn't see my boobies. <laughs> oh my gosh. See, this is what I miss when I like miss our day of streaming. <laughs> I love just hanging out. I, like, I, I know we're gonna play DVD in a minute, but I love hanging out and just enjoying everyone's company. You guys are the best. Oh, Moist Cop Wombat is my other friend. I thought it was like the killer, maybe. I was like, ooh, okay. Well, they deserve it too. Like I said, friends. Friends get things for free. Also, just a heads up, you guys are Dead by Daylight players. Log in! The log in! There's free logins! Rewards is what I mean, not free logins. They're free login rewards. So if you guys are Dead by Daylight players, don't forget to log in today and get your rewards! It is currently, I can't see what it says on my screen. 30,000 BP, 500 shards. So yes, if you guys are Dead by Daylight players, log in, get your gift. That expires tomorrow, I think. So tomorrow's the last day for rewards to log in. Um, I think it's usually like 11 a.m. Eastern. It, expires so i never get my last day but um that'll go into effect tomorrow or that'll be in end tomorrow then on or also tomorrow is the mid chapter update so that'll be out tomorrow not the mori system that will not be in the update so just kind of a heads up no mori system will be in the update tomorrow but that's coming out today i think new cosmetics came out we'll go check those out in a minute and then on Thursday is the Halloween event, and I am so stoked for this Halloween event. I cannot wait, because I want some of the items. Oh, also, then on Wednesday, the Tome opens as well. So that's why I named my stream Counting Down to Everything, because there's so much happening this week in Dead by Daylight, and I cannot wait for any of it. I turned on my camera in Discord to show them my snack collection. I showed my boob in the camera instead. <laughs> well, that... That could be a snack. I charged magic for that. <laughs> Log in for everybody! <laughs> uh, you guys are the best. <laughs> and you should charge for that, though. You should charge for that. Just saying. Just saying. All right, let me hop. But uh, was I gonna do something else? No, I told you guys about everything. That's what's going on. Dead by Daylight this week. Login rewards for everyone! And logins for everyone, too. Uh, new stuff in the tome coming out Wednesday. Update tomorrow. New stuff in the store. Halloween event Thursday. And yeah, I think that's all. <laughs> I think that's all. Just got matched with someone named Vami on my mommy. Oh, dear. I kind of like that name, but oh, dear, at the same time. Again, <laughs> let's hop over to the screen. <laughs> let's get our roller going for the day. And then we will go check out some stuff. I think it was today that new stuff came out in the, um, in the store that we'll go check out. But let's first roll and see who we get. Oh, I guess it would be nice of me to actually put the roller on screen for you guys, right? There you go. <laughs> I don't want to vomit on anyone's mommy. I wouldn't suggest it, no. Unless you're playing Vami Mommy, though. Then, you know, I might. I might have a change of thought. Change of heart. Change of thought. Yeah, same thing. Oh, I was just going to say. So, I owe Walk in Disaster a spin on the wheel as a survivor randomizer i told them i would wait until they were here and then also at the same time 
um, later probably in the stream as well so that we'll change our survivor because it was raining right at the end of the last stream and I really had to go because it was getting late and it was time for dinner. And so um, I owe her a roll on the spinner, but we will roll for the first time today. And then if she pops in, we will roll for her. If not, if she doesn't pop in. It's still on my thing. I've not redeemed her points or anything. So it's there just to let you guys know. I do have one pending to roll. But right now we're going to roll for our first survivor of the day. So let's see who we get. And then we'll go check out stuff in the store if it is in fact there. I think it was. It almost landed on Ace. Welcome to my world, bitch. I'm hated! Welcome on into the stream. Thank you so much for the follow. We got Fang! We get to play Fang for a little while. I'm not I'm not upset about that. Not at all. Not at all. So we will be playing Fang for at least a little while until either Walking Disaster either pops in or until someone else redeems it. That's how we play here as I spin. I don't main anybody. I technically main Michaela off stream, but I don't main anybody. And we'll be playing whoever I got as my roller, and that is who I got. Are you allowing people to join? No, I do not have um, open lobbies. I do not have open lobbies when I'm streaming. I have a solo queue on stream. I played her like two days ago, just one match in the middle of the night when I couldn't sleep. I got one kill, but I got a bunch of hooks. Some was on second hook, but only one sacrifice. That's not bad, though. No. I'm not late, you are. I'm not late, you are. Oh, Hi, Brad. How's good. it going? I... Thank you so much for the shout outs. And the hug outs. And all the outs. <laughs> um, but that's not bad at all. You guys saw my last Vommy Mommy match, which was what? Did we play Vommy Mommy on Wednesday? Well, last week sometime we played her. Didn't go so well. I don't remember what I ended up getting. I don't know if I got any kills or, or even anyone on second hook, but... My Vommy Mommy matches always go one way or another. Usually the bad way, because I get so focused on vomiting on people that I forget, like, not forget, but I just don't ever get the, um, the, um, you know, hooks or anything. <gasps> I'm hated. Thank you so much for feeding Sally and making her a dance. I still like her and I really want to puke on people's faces sometimes. Same. I'm the same. Like, I love playing her. She's a lot of fun. And I love, like, I love everything about her. I'm just really bad at her. Because, like you said, I just like sometimes just puking on people. And sometimes when the match starts to go sour in my favor, I'll just start puking on people. I don't care anymore. <laughs> I don't care anymore. I'll just start puking on people. All right, so I got my, uh, my login reward. Let me go over here and see what was new in the store. I thought it was today. Hmm. This is this an old tome item? Yeah, because I owned. <laughs> I owned some of this item, which means it was a tome item and I didn't finish. I didn't get the top. So never mind. I guess the new stuff didn't come out today. That must be tomorrow. All right, never mind. I'll take back what I said. The new stuff does not come out today or it comes out later. Let me go look at something. Wait, that's not what I wanted. Cause there's like a new bunch of new items coming out. That's the community of it. It's fine, you're on here. You have to go in the seat. Never mind! No new stuff in the store! Well, there's new stuff in the store, but it's old tow items, so. Um, forget what I said. It's probably tomorrow. I thought it was today for some reason. Oh, I love it! I didn't even notice there was a chip hook. Thank you so much for reading me, Skylet the Chipmunk. I hope you enjoy my chipmunk plays. <laughs> Good now? That is a really good build. Stall Jen's like a champ, for sure. God damn it! Artis is one of my favorites too, though. She's a lot of fun to play, and I will 
Well, we say this. God damn it! But because of the Seriously, audience, this is why I enjoy playing killer. Because um, I never really played killer before her, and then her chapter came out. I gave her a try, because she looks fun. And I had so much fun playing her that it got me to really try to get other killers as well, and enjoy playing killer. And don't enjoy playing killer all the time. But she is the one that got me into giving killer more of a chance. I love 
I mean, we could do distortion. Hmm. Maybe we'll try distortion and hope that I have some tokens. That way they won't know where I'm at. But I kind of want an exhaustion perk. <laughs> you know what? Let's try this build. Let's try this build. Um, I'm going to have to put some points into her. I don't have a... I have a broken key. What? What does a broken key do? Could, do I, can I add things to it that makes a broken key even worth my time? Cause I actually don't know freaking how to work a broken key. Broken key's power can be triggered by itself. Various objects can be attached to its jump ring, which channels the broken key's power into various effects. So does that mean I have to have add-ons? Pickled frogs? Ew. Ew! I love distortion. I use it all the time these days. I have not used distortion, I don't think, barely ever. And I have no real reason. Like, just not one that's ever been in my lineup. And I'm trying to do some kind of build that would help me if I get to the end game to find Hatch. And I'm hoping with Distortion that my, my aura, like, I won't be seen. It also hides my scratch marks, which Slow Profile does as well. But mainly, I don't want to be seen. I can help it because if we get down to that point of the game I will go hide in main building because I'm throwing out a hatch offering for main I was trying <laughs> I was trying to read <laughs> I was trying to read what bear said and I read broken key and then Brad wrote something so I wrote I read broken key does what a normal last night and Berea didn't play with me and I'm like what what does that mean <laughs> Because it moved and I didn't even notice. Excuse me. Broken key does what a normal key does. Just can't open hatch. Then what's the point of a broken key? Well, I mean, I get it. But I want to freaking open hatch. I don't want this broken key. Yeah, I've never, ever, ever... Ever... Used a broken key. Okay, well, we're not playing with that. I have no keys, unfortunately. That would be a good thing to bring. We'll put some points into Fang later. And maybe get some, but right now... Let's go with this build. Let's try this and see if it works. We'll try this build and see if it works. Um, if it doesn't, we'll change out something. Broken key is pointless, but... We have two people in this match with the same name. <laughs> Apparently we're playing with a Swift. Or at least two people. But yeah, I've never really played with Distortion. I, I, pro I, I know I played with it. 
excuse me, when I had to, um, not prestige, what's the word? Adept. It's Jeff, right? It's his perk. Yeah. When I had to adept Jeff, but that's the only time I ever used it, so I'm kind of anxious. That was creepy. <laughs> magic! Thank you so much for gifting Maria sub to, sub to the Maria. channel! Unlock the magic gifted a tier 1 sub to just Maria. They have given 118 gift subs in the channel. Thank you so much, Magic, for that gifted sub! I freaking love that alert because it actually scares me. <laughs> I had it took, took me a second to be like, here's something. All right, hatch, main building, if we get there. I didn't bring any items either because I'm gonna go see if I can find some chests and see if maybe we can find a key in a chest. This will be the time I never find a key in a chest. But today, since we're playing Fang, my points will go into her. Also, I need to find a totem. My, I already, one of my distortion tokens is already gone. All right, let's do a gen for a few minutes and then we'll go see if we can find it. A totem. Do I have the... Yes, I do have the sound on for you guys. Okay. I don't know why I feel like it's going to be like a ghosty or a Mikey. Yep. I gotta remember I don't have head on or anything like that. Is there a totem here? No. Because I'm so used to running. Oh, frick! I was trying to get off. Oh, totem. I'm so used to running head on that I like to jump into lockers now. In quick and quiet. <gasps> sip, sip! All right, can do. Just one moment. I got, I got a ghosty lurking around. Is this basement? It's not, oh, a chest though. Well, I have a med kit, that's okay. All right, I have a spare moment, so let's do some sip sip real quick. for the sip sip. See if I can finish this gen. My distortion's all gone. It's okay. It's okay. I'm in his terror radius. I don't like to just 
stop gens from regressing anymore because every freaking time I do, they have uh, um. Overcharge, I swear. So my deep state of contemplation a few days ago didn't reach any conclusions. Oh no, I'm sorry, Denny. I don't think she wants healed, David. I'll do the gen. <laughs> I'll watch out, do the gen. You guys got this. Actually, I don't think we should be doing this gen, but that's okay. The cabin. They go. Also, I apologize if I'm not talking as much. For some reason, when I play ghost against ghost face, I feel like I have to really concentrate. More so for some reason, ghost face than like Mikey. I think it's because I've been not burned, but I've been caught by Mike or by a ghost face. Whoa, he's over there. Way more than I have Mikey. Trying to watch where he was going and I ran right into the right into the wall. What do you call it? a dinosaur made of cheese? I don't know. This probably won't be a hatch match unless we are the last survivor left. Which I don't know, should we like risk it today? Meaning like, uh, doors are open, everyone's standing at the door. And then we just stay in the tryout looking for hatch. She went that way. I'll, I'll go over here. <laughs> Sir, eruption. I love that perk. Saying, I can't do anything until like spires or Gorgonzilla. Am I saying that right? <laughs> He's currently in chase. I might be able to make it over here. Yeah. Want to heal yourself? I got you. I got you. Oh, I was trying to take the body block and I couldn't get in front of her. Sucks. Now he's gonna get her out of the game. I saw him coming. I tried to go around and get in front of her, and 
on accident, she kind of body blocked me into getting in front of her. You know what I mean? Like, she didn't do it on purpose. All right, um... Hmm. Let's just go back this way, I guess. I... Jen over there. I don't know where the other gens are. Okay. So there's a gen I know that's over there. Let's go back over here. Main building gen, maybe? You get my med kit so I can get it out of my hands. There you go. Put that there. Okay, I can't use clairvoyance anymore or I'll have to go do another totem, which I haven't seen. I've got about half left. What do ghosts say when they are impressed? <laughs> they, oh, they was spect, spect, I can't say that. A skeleton walks into a bar and asks for a beer and a mop. Uh huh. And. <laughs> Alright, well, we looked our way. Well, we didn't need adrenaline. Unfortunately, unless see if there's a key down here. Unfortunately, there's no hatch yet. Put a boogie in it. <laughs> Toolbox. All right, no key in case we need it. Oh, he's out of my. No, David, you need to open the door and leave. <laughs> David, you need to open the door and leave. She's dead. I literally am going to sit in this locker and see because she's dead. Unless he went to save her. Hoping David's at a door and he just leaves. I'm sorry, anytime I see a skeleton joke, it reminds me of skeleton's favorite snack video. What do you call- wait, what do you call it when Batman skips church? <gasps> Got it! <laughs> we just came through a hatch! And we didn't really even need technically any of our perks <laughs> but our offering came in handy gg ggwp that was actually a fun game double pip too snap so the ghost face had barbecue which was good we've gotten a locker right there at the end i don't know if i had any distortion left though didn't notice a uh, lethal pursuer eruption we saw and then bitter murmur. Finally, we got through freaking hatch. But we actually didn't need any of our perks. <laughs> None of them came in handy for at least hatch. Clairvoyance would have, but I had the hatch offering. So luckily I was able to be in the area. Luckily the Kate, unfortunately for her, died. And I'm glad David was able to open the door and leave. 
Um, low profile would have come in handy, though, if I wasn't in the area. And I don't know if I had adrenaline, or adrenaline, sorry, distortion value left. I think I was out. I don't know, though. <laughs> Christian Bale. <laughs> oh, that one's, I don't think I've ever heard that before. That one's a good one. What kind of horse do ghosts ride, and why is it so easy to trick a leaf in October? I just saw this one! No, you posted that one in the Discord, Denny! Oh, what was the punchline? Oh, frick, it was something about... F something about fall, and I can't remember! Well, we finally got our challenge done, so... First try! First match of the day, first try. Let's go. A nightmare! I was trying to think of different horses and I couldn't think of that. I was like, ghost horse, like, I was thinking, you know, Ghost Rider. Like, the movie, I've never seen it, but I remember the movie. It was like, Ghost Rider? I'm like, no, no, that wouldn't make sense. Cause they'll fall for anything! That was it! <laughs> I knew it was something fall! I couldn't remember, though, the actual punchline. I liked that one. That was a great one. I liked that one, yes. So, let me see. The only thing I have left on Tome 12 survivor-wise... ...is... Uh, stun the killer four times in a single trial. Because the rest are all killer challenges. So, let's go try it. We have one more day to finish current Tome survivor challenges. Um, maybe we'll do, like, something for that. Some kind of build for pallets. Maybe life. We could probably go back to our other build, but use life. Did you hear about the woman who couldn't pay her exorcism bill? Poor thing had her soul repossessed. That was good. <laughs> and now you guys can't see it because my VTuber face. All right, because I have a VTuber and the VTuber doesn't make the face, but that was a good one. Read a book called, whoa, I expect it was written by a ghost writer. Oh my gosh, you guys are full of it today. <laughs> Is there anything, like, a build that would be good for, like, stunning the killer? Oh, wait, life wouldn't be good because... No, it could be. Because life, it's not, it's not about, um... It's about vaulting the pallet. I know smash hit actually works pretty well. After stunning the killer with the pallet, breaking to a sprint for 100%... 150% of your normal running speed for four seconds causes the ex exhaustion. So that one's not actually bad if I can get some stuns in. Then we can get a little bit of the haste. And then um, windows would be a good one. Does windows do pallets? Yeah. For some reason, I always forget. Win oh, sorry. Windows does pallets. I always think Windows only does <laughs> Windows. Because <laughs> I don't use it often either. I have noticed that ghosts on elevators always seem to be happy. I think it raises their spirits. You know what? You know what? You know what? Wrong button. Wrong button. Wait, I have, I have something new for this. These are all bad jokes. You guys are just... <laughs> You guys have such bad jokes today. <laughs> In a good way. <laughs> I I need a face palm emote bad. I need one of them, because that's what I want to do right now. If I had hands for my VTuber to move, that's what you guys would be getting right now. A bunch of me face palming it. Also, thanks to whoever in that last match brought, um, I think, a flaw, and I got lots of points. Let's put a couple points into Fang. Real quick and see if we get something good. I'm missing kind of basic, um... Basic items, like brown items, I mean. Because I think we just played her recently, actually. I think just recently we were... Our spinner gave us a fag match. 
Why did the zombie ace the exam? I read that. I was going to read that differently. I was going to read a zombie ace. Why did the zombie... It was a no-brainer. Oh my god. I think ghosts don't like parties because they got no bodies to dance with. <laughs> Actually good for a scarecrow too, by the way. Why did like the scarecrow uh, scarecrow ace the exam? I like zombie batter, but actually, you know what I should be doing? I should be putting I should be putting points into um, Rebecca and Ada so I can have theirs unlocked for everybody. Because DVD came out with an update the other day to people's accounts. Oh, I don't have that. Let me grab that real quick. All of my survivors are now at least P3. They fixed the, um, whatever problem they had when the new prestige system went into effect. So everybody I have is at least P3 now. And, um, or higher. Five for Claudette, four for Dwight, who I've put more points into. So all of my survivors got their prestige three. And I need to work probably on Ada and Rebecca because they're only Prestige 1 because they came out after that update. Oops, I'm right on thing. So I need to go probably put points into them so that we could um, get their perks unlocked for everybody in tiers 2 and 3. I think the ghost in the chicken coop was a, a poultry geist. Oh my gosh. We need to have an e exorcism. That's hard to say. Exorcism. E exorcism. <laughs> that one's hard to say. All right, what am I doing? Stunning the killer. You know what? Let's get some practice with our flashlights in. If we're going to bring... Try and be throwing lots of pallets. I'm trying to decide a different build um, that would work. That would just be nice for pallets. So, windows would be good because I'll find them, smash it. If we get the hidden, at least we'll be able to run. And then we could just play with some, like, fun perks I don't normally play with just to be different. Um, what is that one flashlight perk of Hattie's that I actually don't like because I don't play with flashlights? Residual manifest? After a successful blind action, the killer is affected by the blindness for 30 seconds. I mean, we could do that to be different. That is also the name of a horror movie. Poultry Geist is actually a horror movie? Hex booty! Oh my god, I've been watching your stream for like 30 minutes and I haven't said anything. No, no worries. If you want to lurk. That is completely understandable. I totally get it. But hello, Hex Boutte. I love your name, by the way. Love the name. How's it going? Welcome on in, though. Uh, I've been streaming for an hour and a half, and I've only played one match. <laughs> We're trying new builds, so I'm trying to do some different stuff today. I mean, we could keep distortion. No, because I kind of want the killer to fight me, so they'll chase me. Can't think of any more perks though that are um, anything would help with palettes. I guess I'll just stick on something fun. And the reason I'm putting residual manifest on is like, well, I have a flashlight. Why not try something completely different? Um, maybe wiretap to see if the killer is near. Or lightweight, no, let's try lightweight, then we'll like lose him. Cause I don't wanna like stun him like all the time. Let's go score this. Very different build, I'm trying new builds today instead of going with my normal. 
ghosts are rubbish at lying. You can't... S oh, you can! Excuse me. You can see right through them. <laughs> Why did Snowball become a Christian? It would have... It wouldn't have a chance in hell! <laughs> Hex the hair. Hex Boote. I love the name. I just have to say it again because I like it. <laughs> oh no, Killer's bound to have light bore now with two flashlights, right? Because that's what I do. Oh, I have some dailies I need to work on. Oh, we might have to switch to Jane, Jane for like a match or two because we have to rescue three survivors as Jane. Maybe after this match, we'll switch over to Jane for a couple matches. And get that challenge done. This is my kind of music. Isn't it nice? It was called Alternative. It's the alternative station on Pretzel Rocks. And it's definitely my kind of vibe too. I thought about putting Chiptune back on. But I wanted to see what Alternative was all about. What do you call it when a rabbit gets a divorce? Hmm. I can't think of anything. I'm trying to think of something like hair, but I don't think it's that. <laughs> oh, I was close! I was thinking something hairs, and I couldn't think of it. <laughs> Splitting hairs. You know me, this edit country is my stuff. Anything with guitars? I do, yep. Same. Well, I do like country music as well, but I'm also, with music, I like just about anything. I don't have one, well, I go more toward, like, alternative, rock, that kind of genre is my favorite, but my Spotify playlist literally has anything from pop to metal to country to rock to a Disney song. <laughs> it's, like, a wide range of music I like. A hunty. Okay. Not the kind of killer you want to get. Trying to throw pallets in their face. Welcome to my world, bitch. She will just hit you with them pallets. Do you play with viewers? Not normally, no. I normally um, stream um, solo because I just like to stream solo. But, um, and I also kind of have social anxiety, so I have trouble committing to this, but I do want to, like, in the future. But at the moment, I don't have any plans, and I'm not going to be today. And thank you so much, Hex Boote, for the follow, and welcome on into Skelly Town. Mom, get the camera! Just went down. <laughs> because, yeah, because, yeah, that too. 99% of the time she switches between killer and cyber. Today I probably won't be doing that, but 99% of the time that is how I play as well. The only reason I'm not today doing that, just as a putting it out there, is one, it's right before rank reset. And, um, Killer kind of scares me before rank reset. And also, I'm a survivor main, and I'd rather get my... I was going for her. I'd rather get my, um... Ah, someone got her! Survivor rank up right now, since rank reset is on Thursday. Sounds like my CD case. It's just a massive... A massive mixes. Same. That's my Spotify playlist. It'll have just about anything. The one I stick on when I'm in the car. Actually, I think my main playlist doesn't have Disney. I have a specific playlist for Disney because I love Disney music. But it could have Disney music. And it has a very wide variety. I will always gravitate toward rock music. Because it's what I love the most. I have a flashlight, so I should be over there, but I brought it for pallets. What is going on? Do we have a good 
huntress with her hatchets or Unfortunately, from a flashlight, I was in the wrong spot. Sorry, I didn't mean to double, double grab you there. Do you want heals? your stream up and live on TikTok where they are reading <gasps> Ooh, a reading of a Harry Potter book? Ooh, that sounds fun. Well, pallets are down over here. Speaking of just blah, blah. speaking of Disney, just thought of another dumb joke. Why does Ka needs a need needs a need a lawyer? Going this way. Wow. Come on, she had to have seen me there, right? I wasn't hiding. Hmm. Oops. There's no. He's trying to set up a trust fun. <laughs> I can't do the, I can't do the call, uh, like, tongue thing. A trust the final. Well, so because, well, I'll, well, bleh, I can't read and y'all know this. Mom, get the camera's dead. Uh, well, she also plays Survivor and she escapes. She plays a killer and then goes back to Survivor. So it's a cycle, yes. That is how I normally play here on stream, yes. If anyone is new, I don't play with viewers a lot of the time because one, I prefer solo and I like to pop gens. Um, <laughs> but I also do play a cycle. I do play Survivor, Toys 5, then Killer. Right before rank reset, I don't do that normally because I don't like playing Killer before rank reset. And I would much rather rank up my Survivor today since we've got, what, two days left? But I am one of those interesting people who absolutely loves solo queue. I don't know what it is. I mean, I don't not like playing with friends, but I love solo queue. I think it's because I don't really get upset about what others are doing. I mean, yeah, I'll get annoyed, but I don't normally really get upset. I'm gonna take this out because she has no head. And I find it entertaining sometimes. I freaking like, you know, watching somebody stand in a corner doing nothing and I'm hanging on hook. It's like, this is kind of funny. I don't know why, but it's kind of funny. Mm, I don't, uh, not close enough to get that. Oh, I know! I really can't wait for the new artist outfit and the new tome. I know. Uh, same. It's so gorgeous looking. I think... She camp in basement? Kinda, but I should be able to get this. Uh, 
Hey, I'm leaving. I'll go back for my flashlight. Wait! Who? Who? Wait a minute! I just opened this! Who took the med kit I was leaving there for me? <laughs> I think it was the Nia. <laughs> I opened that, saw it was a med kit, and I was gonna go back to it. And Nia ran by it and stole it! No, not really. She deserved it. Wow, it's a big dumb. <laughs> I swear she was in the building, so I didn't even look behind me. Anyway, this gives me a chance to read chat. I'm excited. Say, Mahali, hello. Thank you so much for the work. I hope you've been doing well. If I have a mod available, could I please get a shout out for Holly, please? But as I was saying before I got interrupted by the Huntress, we were talking about this earlier. I love, I love artists. I don't have very many outfits for her because she doesn't have a lot. She has a few here and there. And I didn't get the Prime outfit back black last year because I don't have Prime. But it's so gorgeous. I'm so excited for it. It's probably the one I'm excited for the most of everything in the tome. Thank you. Because the Yui one's nice, but I don't love it. It's nice. I don't know what she's pointing at, but I'm going this way. Well, I'm not going to get any stuns in on her. But it's also a Huntress. It's hard to get stuns in on Huntress if they're going to have hatchets all the time. I... Nope, she's coming for me. I don't have quick and quiet, and I don't have head on. <laughs> How did she not hear me get in this locker? I'm baffled. Why was Leatherface show canceled? Cost the studio an arm and a leg. I don't have head on. You're gonna have to grab me out of here because I don't have it. I like to sometimes, if I know I'm not really gonna outrun them, I like to make them pull me out of the locker instead of them getting the down on me. I like the new Yui outfit a lot. It was very clean as well. No, I don't dislike it, but I don't. It's not like my favorite in the tome. I do actually really like it, but I'm super excited for the um artist's outfit and then I'm not a ghost flare but ghost flare ghost face player but I do like the masks that are coming <laughs> and then Michaela's my love so she's got some stuff um and then with the upcoming um Halloween event I'm really excited for some of the stuff that's going to be in that as well but yeah the Yui one I do like I really do like it I'm just more excited for the artists. Here, I'm gonna go, um, I think she's being chased. But she's... 
I'm gonna give her, no, she's being chased. I'm gonna at least give her an option for hatch. Maybe she'll get lucky and it'll spawn in front of her. No way she was getting to me, so it's okay. Thank you, Brad, for giving Holly a shout out. I don't remember. Da, is the Kate and White um, outfits, are those both gonna be in the holiday, or event um, tome? Or are they gonna be in the store? I think the Kate one was gonna be the event. No! She got her! Damn! I was hoping that Hatch would be near her. Right? I'll be playing no perk ghost face with that mask and meme everyone. Same. Like, I will never ever again play. Well, I probably will, but <laughs> I will never again want to play a ghost face match seriously when I have that mask equipped. Because I'm literally gonna just stick it on and I'm just gonna meme with everybody for sure. I don't even really like playing ghost face that much because I'm not a sneaky player. So I'd rather just put it on and beam. Uh, oh, they had Iron Maiden! Oh, well, I never came out of the locker. But I didn't have, like, head on. I was already injured anyway, so it wouldn't have mattered. F Floods of Rage. Oh, sorry. I think they might have all gone or been console, but... Not bad, not bad. Yeah, Huntress is not someone I like to throw pals. Never had the opportunity either, but also not someone I want to throw pallets against. <gasps> Peanut butter crackers and coffee has been acquired? That sounds so good. Speaking of food. Ice cream with a can of tuna. Ew. No thank you, bot. I put a couple new things in the bot for food. I think I put two new main courses and then one, maybe two new sides. So the main is always the first one, side is considered the second one. Um, cause I didn't have s'mores on there and we like to joke that when someone's camping us, that we're on a camping trip making s'mores, I didn't have that in my bot. So I threw that in there. Pineapple pizza with a piece of string cheese? That actually isn't bad. I don't like pineapple pizza, but I would take it over my ice cream and a can of tuna for sure. <laughs> well, but I got spring, spring. String cheese, too. A meatloaf with a piece of string cheese. That's actually not bad at all. Bot wants to hand out string cheese today, I guess. I don't know. You know, some days the bot likes to give us anchovies. So I guess I would rather take the string cheese than the anchovies. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go play Jane for a couple rounds because I have a daily ritual. Oh, no, Gara's twins one. I don't do that either. But anyways, uh, rescue three survivors with Jane. So we're gonna go play Jade. Um, oh my gosh. I haven't played her in so long that I don't even have my normal build on. Um, I think I'll stick on my normal build for this though. Mm, no, actually, you know what? Maybe I won't. Donut with a pile of bacon. Hell to the yes. Oh my gosh, that is heaven, I agree. I agree, Brad. That sounds really good. No! Does Jane not have will make it? Ah, Jane! Why? I was gonna put on will make it. Uh, cause it's my favorite perk I have to use when I'm doing these kind of challenges. Um... We could put on borrowed time to give him some extra time. And then maybe, um, I'm trying different builds today. We're going to be doing different builds today. Um, if we're working on certain challenges, because I just want to try it. I want to do something different. Let's put on power. Excuse me, smash hit, not power hit. <gasps> be right back. I'm going to take the doggo out real quick. All right, no worries. No worries, Rakaku. Is she a guys with a sheet that highlights her flotations? Maybe. Maybe. Man, I had that song stuck in my head. Like, all last week. All week, I was freaking singing that song. Uh, 
or at least humming the tune. I couldn't remember all the exact lyrics, and I kept screwing them up in my head. I have my favorite line, though. Where everything will be pumpkin spice, or every, where everything is pumpkin spice, I know I'll be all right. That is me. <laughs> that is so me, that lyric. I'm looking for, I don't know, it's it should be back here. No, not that one. Better than new. That'll give them some speed. I don't have the healing one, though. I don't have we'll make it, and I'm saying. What was my challenge? Oh yeah, so let's just do a, a weird build. Um, not necessarily bad by any means, which is weird for it has no real purpose. Uh, <laughs> windows to find pallets to see if we can do some stuns. Smash it. It'll give us some uh, speed. Better than new. We'll rescue people off the hook. Give them some speed. Since I don't have, um, we'll make it apparently. And then borrow time will give them a little bit of extra time, hopefully, to survive in case we do get someone who wants to chase right after hook. Because I need to successfully, uh, successfully rescue people, I'm assuming, right? Oh, it just says rescue. It doesn't say they have to be safe, but I want to make sure they're safe. Oops, I don't want character info. I gotta put on my spoopy charms. Oh, I don't know if I got that. There you go, my spoopy charms. My fave, put the donut in the microwave and get them just a little warm. Oh, yes. <laughs> Your best YouTube channel on repeat. <laughs> I freaking loved it. I listened to it like a few times um, the first day I saw it. And I haven't even needed to put it on repeat or anything because it's been freaking in my head the last few days. Um, I think the last few days actually it hasn't been, but a few days after I first watched it, I swear it, w it was just in my head and I could not get it out. Power matches? Not too bad. Not too bad. I have no complaints. We'll just put it that way. It's so freaking catchy. It is. It's weird doing solo queue, I bet. After being used to a swift, I bet. Yeah, I've, when I've, I've played like two matches. Because for the last like half hour, I've been trying to pick perks to go with my challenges. And we're trying different builds. But the first match actually was good. We got our hatch, so I was glad by that. And then the second match, um, nothing wrong with it. Just Huntress got me. I did! Yes! I did see your Mikey TikTok. Because <laughs> I was sitting there and it popped up on my, cause my friend's feed or whatever it's called on TikTok. And I saw it, I was like, oh my lord. Loved it though. Loved it. That that was the song that replaced the 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 poltergeist song in my head. Was the song that Magic had on that clip. That one's now been stuck in my head for like the last two days. It was originally the poltergeist song. And then I think I saw that clip. And then my brain went immediately oops sorry. Immediately to that song for the last three, four days. I normally don't like going after the gen I first see. And we'll go back to playing Fang here in a few moments. I just want to see if I can get my daily done with. What do you see, Fang? A pyramid head. Yeah, run him away. Get him away from me. I'll do Jed. Bang! Man, why'd you come back over here? Ah, oh, 
come on now. Rude. Probably because there was a pallet there. This is another killer. It's kind of hard to stun because he could just do his stuff. Whatever that stuff is called. <gasps> that is a perk I should put on for my pallet build. Uh, the Yui one that... Dragon script. The Yui one that... um. Yeah, I'm going down. Because I've been dragon gripped. You have almost 3k views on it? Nice! It was a good one. I loved it. I'm proud of you, Magic. That's awesome. I've never had a TikTok at a thousand yet. So that's freaking awesome. Yeah, thank you. Any means necessary. I was trying to think of what it was called. I was like, I know it's a Yui perk. I just couldn't think of the name. But that would be a good perk to use. So we could go um, smash hit, windows of opportunity, any means necessary, and then stick on something else for um, just fun or something to help us just in the match in general. One view away, and then 458 likes. 31 have favorited it. It's insane. That is freaking amazing, though. That is freaking amazing. I love to see it. Well, I've gone to second stage. He's kind of proxy camping. So I am totally booking it. If you manage to pull it off real good, you can stun them by using the pallet. You can stun... Oh, just a second. I must leave. <laughs> I must get lost. There's no offense, I'm not going for the save. I just went to death hook on my first hook. But I have the challenge, so maybe I'll try. I wanna read chat, I wanna see what that said. Nope, he's kinda going back. Let me see if I can pop my gen. Um, anyways, you can stun them by using the pallet. You can stun them if you time it with any means necessary. Then stun them by using the pallet again. Yes, I want to do that. I did that on purpose to hopefully get his attention and come over here. Yeah, he's proxy camping. He won't commit. I mean, I got him away for a minute. Did he kick this? No, so I shouldn't have dragon script. It's difficult to pull off the triple pallet stun, but it's possible. I've seen it happen. I want to try it now. No, he's coming. I wish I could help, but I can't really do anything to get save him. Like, I can get his attention, but... He's definitely a killer when he gets his eyes set on something, he ain't taking his eyes off it. How many- Worried. I ain't four in a single trial, so...
That's fine. I wasn't gonna get away. He didn't hit me with his weapon, though. I didn't even get Mori. I am sad. Did he only have a? Did he not have an Ebony Mori? That just wasn't a good match. That one wasn't good. I went to second stage on my first hook. So did the poor Ace. I don't know why. I think it's because he was kind of proxy camping. So it was harder to get to people. Because right when Ace was, I think it was an Ace, right? Yeah. When he was on a hook, I was trying to not go for the save. I was trying to cause a distraction so somebody else could go. Man, I deep pipped for that. Nothing bugs me more than deep pipping for something that really wasn't my fault. Well, I'm not sticking around. I'm not sticking around. I don't care. <laughs> I'm gonna go start. No, I didn't. I didn't get to rescue anybody as Jane. Boo! So we'll play Jane again. Or did I? No, I didn't get that save. I caused the distraction. No save. Um, let me see what's my build right now. I'm just running a. Let's. This is both a build for rescuing and stunning. Let's take up borrow time and let's put on any means necessary. Um, and we don't really need anything because it's just rescue survivors off the hook. It doesn't say safely. Like the tome sometimes will say rescue so many survivors safely. Um, so I just have to rescue. Mm, we'll just bring that and okay, let's go. I barely get like two stuns in a match. To get a triple one in one go, I would love to do it. I'll give it a I'll give it a good old try. Oh, I was bringing flashlights, but I, I'm not going to. Mm. No, with Jane we'll just bring our bed kit. I was bringing flashlights to practice when I, if I get a hit, but that wouldn't be very effective because if I've got smash hit and I hit him, I want to use my speed to get away and not stop and use my flashlight on him. Also, Taser joined us, so everyone say hi to Taser. How's it going, Taser? I forgot about the park, though, um, any means necessary. There's, like, what? Over 100 perks in this game for Survivor. I tend to forget about some of them. But that will work um, pretty well, I think, with our... Hopefully, stud a killer four times in a match. Brad says hi, Tyser and Maddie. Maddie's actually out today. Usually, when we say hi to her, she's, like, somewhere, I don't know where, sleeping. But she's actually currently out. She's sleeping. But she is where I can see her. <laughs> Taser's gonna need his own fan Twitter soon. <laughs> you know what? Yes. Yes. Because we can't see Maddie anymore like we used to when I had a camera, Taser is like the more dominant presence on the channel because he barks and you can hear him. Where Maddie's a very quiet kitty. You don't hear her often. And now that I don't use a camera, you guys can't see her walking around. But Taser, I even added it to my about me section in my panels because I was like, I used to have it say, you know, if Maddie, you see her, that's who she is and everything. And I was like, well, now you don't see her. So you guys hear him more. So I put him in the, uh, my panels below. And I think I also made a command for him. I think. Not positive on that. <laughs> I've tried using any means necessary here and there. Apparently killers can interrupt you and break... Really? And break the pallet while you're in the middle of trying to get it back up? Oh, I didn't know that. I figured when that was going on that... You know, I don't want to say you were, like, immune to anything, but you know what I mean? Like, I didn't know you could actually still break a pallet. Hi, 
By the... Oh, it's Jake. By the way, earlier... When we were... Oh, they've got corrupt. When we were playing with distortion, I kind of liked that perk. Oh, it's a vomi mommy. It's a vomi mommy, which I should have guessed with corrupt, but a lot of people run corrupt. Why? Um, and maybe this is just me. She's puked on that one, so I'm gonna see if I can run over here. Hope she hasn't puked on the ones over here. Um, has anyone else been getting a lot more vomi mommies, or is it just me? She's probably puked on this. Frick, it's corrupt! I ran all the way over here for a corrupt one. Well, I'll just... I'll just do it. I want food so bad, but I don't want to eat. Oh, Danny, I'm sorry. I know that feeling, though. It sucks. Like, you want food, but you don't want to go through it. You know what I mean? Sorry. Oh. What the? Be free! Nope, you're broken. I'm gonna reset this pallet. Because <laughs> I can. Can't tell what she's doing. Oh, she's going after the Jane, okay. All right, there you go. Did you break this pallet over there? Because I want to reset it. <laughs> I'll just go around resetting all the pallets. See, I keep getting killers where I don't necessarily... Ooh, a hex. I don't necessarily want to be throwing pallets at them. Over here talking about puke and Denny's like, I want food. <laughs> That wasn't probably the best of timing, no, but my tummy ain't that weak. I can sit down and have dinner and watch the grossest movie and it'll be fine. Same. I freaking stuck. Is someone running her around him? Where is she? Oh, is she doing insidious? <laughs> missed me. How? I don't know. Ah, there's no pallet. Oh, missed me again! Oh, I have windows. I knew I was gonna make it. Damn it! Forgot I had- I can see everything! Yet I forgot I had windows of opportunity. But yeah, I'm the same. Like, I normally can sit down and eat dinner, watch pretty gory movies or gross or whatever you want to call them, and not be too affected. It can affect me in a different way, like, not tummy issue wise. Sometimes, depending on the extent of the movie, I guess you could say, not necessarily the goriness. Why is it gory? It'll affect me more in a. I guess you could say mentally? I don't know. It's like, I just, I, I, I can't, like, process it or something. It really will bother me. Not stomach-wise, though. I've never really gotten sick like that from a... anything. Solo queue today has been a lot of gens before friends, though. This is the second match I've gone to second hook. 
I think one person is being chased, but... I don't normally go to second hook this many times. any other perks for her. She had a Hex we got rid of. She's got Thana and she also had Corrupt. I'm trying to figure out what the Hex was because I wasn't really paying close attention. I was not paying close attention to what I cleansed. I just cleansed something really shiny. She's playing well though. But my solo queue experience today has been a little iffy. But it's whatever. Like I said. Man, I freaking have a med kit that is absolutely useless against plague. I'll follow. She knows where I'm at. That's okay. I'll run her away. I am where there is no pallets. There's one in its shack, but I'm not going to throw it. Damn! I is dead. Did. I don't know how many matches did I played today. Three? Did I rescue three survivors? No, I think I only got to two. So I think we have to play one more Jane match before we go back to Fang. I think I only got two done. Yeah. Oops. Self care. Ew. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> anyway, one more Jade match. I have. I've been trying. I mean, this is the challenge. It's going to be hard, anyways, for me, because I'm not much into throwing pallets to stun killers a lot. I mean, I like to do it, but I'm really not great at it. Getting four in a match is going to be rough. Um, unless I get maybe a killer who's got, like, Spirit's Fury who wants you to hit him. Um, but. So far, I've gotten a bunch of killers where it's not very ideal to throw ha hatchets, to throw pallets. We had Huntress. Unless you can time it well, you could probably get it done, but I don't like to because I usually get owned by throwing a pallet against a Huntress. Pyramid Head, if timed right, he could hit you with his weapon and then also then Vommy Mommy will just vomit on you. I keep getting all these killers with range. Now get it. It's possible it can be done. It's just not ideal for me. I am deep hipped again! That is how the day is going. First match of the day, we double pipped. And then I think the next match we pipped, since we have not. We've deep pipped every time. And it's not my fault any time, which is more annoying. A Yoichi. Let's go. I haven't seen a Yoichi in a while. Also, I'm not playing with my normal build, which tends to throw me for the first few matches because my brain gets into the like normal build that's head on, lucky break, um, and all that, and I just my brain goes to ooh ooh where 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 is a locker? Let's hop in it. No. Well, I could hop in it, but not going to be well. 
It's not gonna go well, I mean. Oh, I guess I could take this uh, hosting thing off of my creator's dashboard on Twitch. <laughs> I had it there so I could see everybody who hosted, and that's not a thing anymore, so I could probably take that off. Clean up my creator's dashboard. I think after this match, I need to take a quick break, because I need to use the restroom. My goal today was going to be to get to gold one. Can still happen. It's only three o'clock. I've got three more hours. But the way the matches are going, and we're just going backwards. But it is right for rank reset, so. That is why I'm not playing killer today. Oh, should we work on this gen? Sure. I'm actually kind of scared for the current tome coming out because that means I think we'll get more ghost face players because that it's his tome. And y'all know me and ghost face. I scream probably the most against him. Another pyramid head? What? What? Damn it! I was trying to go thinking where he wasn't going to throw that. And he threw it right there. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I actually will go to a second hook again. against the gay. Come on, give me like a, a Mikey or <laughs> Ghostface from the original match or the first match. Oh, don't bring him over here. I think she was trying to get him to follow her and not me, but... I was- I was wanted to hang around here! See if I can get this shred done with her, though. Unfortunately, yeah, she's gonna beat me there, which is okay. Uh, 
Yay! We healed to me. Did they have sloppy butcher? No, she never healed me. Never mind. I thought she had healed me a little bit, but she didn't. I'm thinking he's gonna go through main. See if I can get over here before anyone else. To get this last save as Jane. Alright, he's following her. Good, good, good. Unless you wait, she pops around the corner here. I got this. Yay! Got my three unhooks. Oh, do not want heals. I think we'll be okay. Frick that. Damn! Let me reset this pallet! <laughs> Ow. Stepped in some goo. Not the good goo either. I had quite a nice red in DVD last night when I played with magic. I almost got to Eerie 2! I was in Eerie 3 and 3 pips when I stopped, and then I lost 2 pips when I played a few matches today. <laughs> Isn't that how it always goes, though? When you're so close to, like, higher up like that, that's when you start deep pipping. You start getting, like, either just bad matches in general, or you're just not good enough to pip. That's how today started. Like, I double pipped, and I'm trying to get at least a gold one. That's my goal. And since then, I've de-pipped. Cause I have two more days, so I have the I have the opportunity to get to I don't know, have I? I don't think I've ever hit Eerie 3. I think the highest I've ever gotten was Eerie 4. And I think from now on, possibly like on streams. Uh when it gets close to rank reset, we'll stop playing killer and we'll focus on our survivors, especially if we're high up there. And see if soon we can hit like maybe Eerie 3 or 2 to be our highest. But I thought today was going to be a good day when I double pipped my very first match and it hasn't gone well since. No, I've never gotten Eerie 1. I know that for a fact. I don't have the achievement on Steam. <laughs> That's a good telltale. I don't have the achievement on Steam of getting Eerie 1 ever. Yeah, I know I've never gotten Eerie 1. I may have hit Eerie 3 once, but I'm unsure. And I may have gotten um, even higher when it used to be um, numbers, like when it used to be 1 through 20. I may have even got pretty high up there then, but I've never hit at least enough to get the achievement on Steam. You've been Eerie 1? That's freaking awesome. Because normally I only play Survivor on stream. Normally if I'm playing off stream these days, I am playing Killer. That's why my Killer rank is a little better this month, is... I played some uh, Killer matches off stream, damn it. Oh, the door is open and I don't know where it is. Ah, this door. Wait, nobody got this person on hook? Wait a minute. I swear as I was running, somebody got them. Wait a minute. Oh, no. Oh, no, whoever you are. Oh, it's the Shiva.
They still have not got them off hook. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Where is everybody? Oh, I feel so bad for whoever's on hook over there. Oh, they got him. They got him, whoever was. Oh, Shiva, that's right, it was Shiva. They got her, whoever I really got her, thank goodness. Cause I was trying, but couldn't get there, couldn't get there. You have been Eerie one once. Yeah, I think, I, I, I seriously can't remember if I ever hit Eerie three. Cause I started playing DVD like a lot last October. And I didn't stream it really then. So I'm not sure if I hit Eerie three off stream back then, but I know for a fact on stream, I've never been there. And then according to my Steam achievements, I've never um, been Eerie one. Um, I don't know if I hit it though before the new ranking system. I know once I got pretty high. Oh, yay, we all got out. Um, I know before the new ranking system, I did get pretty high, but I have no idea what number I ended up getting to because it wasn't on stream either. It was off stream. Because I didn't start mating DVD till late, like December last year, or January this year. Once you hit every one, that's the end of the game, so don't try for it. <laughs> no, that's not the end of the game. That'll make me want Eerie 1 even more. That'll make me want it even more. Did I pip that match? <gasps> I did. All right, I do need to take a quick break. Um, we don't have to play Jane anymore. We did our challenge um, because our roller told us today we are to play Fang. So we will go back to playing her, but I do need to take one quick break to use the restroom. So I will be back in just a few moments. Totally looks like um, they tried to shoot you in your penis. Is that an error or are you happy to see me? I am back. Oh my god, I am so sorry, guys. Mm, don't oh, tell goodness. nobody I did that. Just what did you do? Belch. You do? What the fuck? Alright, I returned. Thank you so much for all the shout outs <laughs> that are still freezing. I was gonna actually try and go back to the other shout out clip player and see if it still froze. It like I don't know something. why it does that. So weird. No clue. We're gonna stay over here for just a sec while the last few go. Why will this not let me scroll up sometime? Thank you. I like this clip. I like this clip. <laughs> Thank you, Brad, too much for all the shoutouts. Roar, I'm a dinosaur. Roar, roar, I'm a dinosaur. What, you're a dinosaur? Yep. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, we survived, so. Or not we survived, uh, we finished with Jane. 
All right, um, let me take off residual manifest because I was just going to use uh, flashlights, but I don't think I will. It makes no sense to use flashlights if I can get a stun in with smash hit. I get speed, so I don't want to stop and go back and blind them. So we'll put on any means necessary, and we'll keep lightweight. Give us a chance to maybe lose the killer. Uh, after, with um, our scratch marks being not quite as prominent. And yeah, stun the killer. Didn't change it. Didn't think I did. I forgot about that one. I liked that clip. That was a good clip. I love the instrument too. Same. I thought it was a really good clip. I was enjoying that. I should have muted my music so we could have heard it better. It's Danny the Dino. <laughs> yeah, that's another good clip though. Yeah, I haven't played in a hot minute. Well, it was very good. I enjoyed it. Did I have any more daily rituals, or was that my last of me? That was my last of my survivors. Okay. I have a Cenobite one, which I probably will get rid of whenever I can, and then I keep the Dredge one on there, because I do love playing the Dredge. The Dredge, excuse me. I'll post a few more on Discord? Yes! Go for it! I'd love to hear it. You're still a newbie? Well, I thought it sounded amazing. I have no musical talent whatsoever, so <laughs> I tried to play the piano when I was younger. Didn't do too bad. I had lessons, but it was I can't do it anymore. But just I have no musical talent in me, which is weird because my dad is a musician and my grandfather was a musician, but me, nope. My brother got it. My brother is a musician. I got none of. It. I got my mom's musical talent, which is none. Yeah, that's it. Then the cookies clip. It's you're saying raw. I'm a dinosaur. <laughs> You've had no lessons, so you're self-taught. Nice, nice, nice. My brother's like that. He plays um bass or guitar. I don't know which one. <laughs> he plays one of them. I don't remember. And he's self-taught. But I'm a person. I don't like to be taught things. Like I don't like having a teacher. I freaking hate it. I like to teach myself stuff. So that's probably why I didn't do very well with playing the piano. But also, I'm just not very talented when it comes to musical instruments. I just have nothing in that realm. Um, but I'm, I'm just a person who I hate being taught things. I like to learn on my own, and it comes with anything. Like, everything I've done on stream, I've learned on my own. I, I researched, I watched videos, I did whatever, you know, I wanted to, to learn. And that's what I like doing. I freaking love to learn things uh, on my own by research or practicing on my own or whatever the case is, you know, depending on what I'm trying to learn. I have good rhythm, but I can't play it. I have no rhythm whatsoever. I get that from my mom's side of the family, though. No, I don't think anybody on her side of the family plays instruments or has any kind of anything like that. Where my dad's side of the family, my uncle has music. My dad can do music and rhythm and all that. My grandfather did. I don't, my grandma didn't have, like, she didn't play anything. Uh, and my brother. Not me. Not at all. You looked up piano tutorials on YouTube? If I had a piano, I would love to pick it back up to see if I could do it in today's time with, like, tutorials on YouTube. But I don't own a piano anymore. <laughs> Actually, I never owned a piano. My grandparents had a piano because my grandfather could play it. But I never had one. I would play on his. We had a keyboard. 
which is very different. My dad had a keyboard that I played on, but it's very different than a piano. You have no skills at all? No, -uh, I've heard you play, Brad. You do. Post it on the music tab? Why, thank you. I will check that out after stream for sure. Is it an Oni? I think we have Oni. Oh no! Oni, come back. See if he's got... No. Dragon's Grip is what I was looking for. A lot of proxy campers today. See? He won't commit. <laughs> he will not commit whatsoever. I have no flashlight or anything to help. But it's right before rank reset. Don't worry, I got this. I left. I think I would have enough time to leave if I'm sitting here. Where? Oh. Yay! So I finished what Jen I was working on. I was gonna go back and pick that up. Come on, come on, get away from her. Stop camping. You just lazy, you just wanna move up. You're just a lazy Odie. And trying to get his attention because everyone's on their way. Get her! Get her! <laughs> Trying to do a drive-by there. Back to my gen! At least everybody got away. They tunneled! Missed that skill check because I was trying to move my cord out of my way. Moi has been a thing today, too. Nice. Now it's my turn to be camped on hook. Oh, wait. Am I going to get camped on hook? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Because he'll probably camp me and then he'll probably... No, he left. Well, he might come back, but he left for the moment. I was going to say tunnel me right after. There you go. Uh-huh. 
Not getting the stuns in, but that's okay. Was who died had the boon, I think. Alright, nice tunneling job, but I was free. Let's go back and see if this gen, how much progress, or how much it has regressed. Quite a bit. play guitar for 35 years but can never play piano. I wish I could have like five keyboards I've picked up over the years. I just couldn't like I was being taught so I couldn't keep the attention you know of being taught. Wish I had adrenaline. <laughs> I'm sad now I wish I had adrenaline. Are they on death hook? No. But he's definitely gonna camp. So I'm gonna try opening this door. Or at least 99ing it. And seeing if the other girl will come over and help heal me. Oh no, she's opening the other door. I can't read a bit of sheet music. I've tried, even took classes. I can't read sheet music either, but I've never actually tried either. <laughs> I pushed it too late. I tried to 99.9 .9 it. Yeah, he's face camping her. Well, I'm not going to give him the pleasure of getting lots of kills by camping, so... He's gonna get two kills by camping. And I'm sorry, I didn't mean to open the door. I was trying to 99 in. I just mistimed it. Sorry, I was just reading through chats while I was quiet. What was he running, just to be curious? Huntress's lullaby? Come on now, if you're gonna camp and have Huntress's lullaby, come on! Welcome to my world, bitch. You're not gonna get very much value. <laughs> Mushroom, hello, thank you so much for the follow. I'm so sorry we couldn't save you right there at the end. I think it was you on hook, right? Right at the end. I'm so sorry. I was just a camper, so it was hard to get to anybody. I was reading what they were running. But welcome on into Skelly Town. Thank you so much for the follow. I'm so sorry. The match went that way. I was injured right at the end, so I was hoping I could find the Yui to heal me so we could maybe provide a... Taser says hi. Uh, so we could probably provide some kind of distraction, but... Oh yeah, the mailman's here. This time the mailman really is here. Just one moment. Right back sorry yeah it's cool sorry yeah sorry i had to get up my dog was barking uh it just uh, yeah, it, 
just, just camper, you know? And if you play DVD long enough, sometimes you understand. Like, I don't like sacrificing anybody when it comes down to it, you know? It, it, in the end game, if they're camping, it's like, I try to save everybody. I was injured, and there was probably not much I could do. But I tried my hardest to get back over there, and hopefully... I didn't mean to open the door, either! I was trying to 99 it, and I just misclicked and did not take my finger off it fast enough. Like I said, in the end there, when you see a camper and someone's on a hook, it's like, I'm going to try and get out, but not give them any more kills. You know what I mean? If they're going to camp and play that kind of style of game, I'm going to try and make sure they don't get as many kills as possible. Yeah, not much you can do when they, you camp. Not really. Um, if, if I was with a Swift, you could communicate better and try and cause a distraction and stuff, you know, and everything. But since I'm so low-Q, I couldn't tell the UE, like, hey, come over! Let's try and get it. <laughs> but um, I was also injured, so it was either possibly go down because I wouldn't be able to get there in time and give him even more uh, points for a lazy gameplay, you know what I mean? Or sadly sacrifice. If I'm the one on hook and someone's camping, I would rather everybody just leave and get the points instead of saving me because I'm. if I don't survive, I don't survive. I'm all good. I'm all good, but you played a wonderful game, and you guys were really fun to play with. I enjoyed the match, other than having to, you know, work around the, work around the, um, tunnel. He kind of tunneled, too, a little bit, because as soon as I got off hook, uh, he was coming for me, for sure, and then I lost him somewhere. So I was able to at least get free, but I couldn't, I think it was the Fang who, um, died. I think it was the Fang who had the boon, so I was gone. Oh, well, it'd be like that sometimes, though. It'd be like that sometimes. But it was still fun to play with you. I was trying to buy you guys some time so we wouldn't go back and bother you guys. That's freaking nice. That's really awesome. I, I do the same, though. I do the same. And in solo queue, it's like you never know... You never know if that person is doing that, buying you time... Or, um, if they're gonna be, like, in the end game chat all salty that you didn't come back and save them, you know what I mean? Because I do the same. If I'm on the hook and I'm being either camped or proxy camped or whatever is going on, um, I'm trying usually to struggle to give you remaining people in the match time to either get to a door or whatever. Because I would rather me die on hook if I'm already there than him getting more kills for camping. And then sometimes if you're the last survivor left and I'm on a hook and I notice he's, like, not camping, but, you know, maybe in the area, I will literally kill myself on hook so that hopefully the last person surviving can get hatch. But I play the same way. I play the same way. Hmm. I guess I'll do this, Jen. Like I said, it's always hard in solo queue to, you know, figure out if the survivor is trying to do that or if they are going to get all salty. Like, I don't really mind if someone got salty at me for it. It's like, well, sorry. Oh, it's a booba! I, sorry! I got excited! It was a booba! <laughs> Not really excited, no. Um, more terrified, but I didn't mean to pop that gen. I saw the booba and then I pushed my skill check for some reason. Where'd the booba go? A booba with barbecue? Run him, yo, AJ, run him! I got you, I got you. lightweight perk today. Ah! Damn it, I couldn't get around the corner. 
I was trying to get around the corner so that hopefully you would hit the side, but... I didn't have the speed! Uh, this booba came to play. This booba said, mm -mm, no! No survivors! Also, Reap and Seek. I feel like I've played against them before. Their name sounds very familiar. Yeah, I think we're going to deep pip this match too. <laughs> Did I pip up last match? I wasn't paying attention. I'm trying not to pay attention today if I'm pipping because it's starting to get depressing that I'm not. No, no heal. No heals. You don't heal against a booba. Booba just one hit you. At least I can get some maybe ultraism points here. Jill, I think, has tried to kill herself. I think she went. She did that for that reason. I mean, I'm not gonna fault the booba. He's doing a great job. We are not gonna be able to do anything. We're not gonna get any gens done. The best we can hope for is points from our altruism. Oh, I didn't come this way. Well, I'm leaving. Doodles, booba. I'm, I'm not even gonna touch Jen. <laughs> What's the point of touching a Jen when we have five left and pretty much... Uh, oh, uh, he's not on death hook. Pretty much no hope. Other than points. Oh, he has barbecue. Booba's barbecuing me. I don't know if I can get up there. Ultraism points. All right. Oh, no! He went down again! No! Oh, I guess I'll touch a gen just for some points now. Here in my toolbox. All right. Got rid of my toolbox. What the? Sir! No! You gonna come up here? Should we make Booba pull us out of a locker? Oh, I didn't come over this way anyway. Ooh, what's this? Oh, dead med- uh, dead- Dead toolbox! Alright, I'll work on a gen for some points. Yeah, I'm gonna make him pull me out of the locker now because I don't want him to get hit. Yo, Ichi, go hide! Hide! Don't save me! He might have barbecue and chili, but I kind of don't think he does. Good, Yoichi. I'm gonna, I am gonna kill myself on hook just to give him a fighting chance. No, Yoichi! Yeah, let's get back in the locker. This is for you! Save yourself! <laughs> Normally, I would, like, probably not do that. I don't die. I don't kill myself on a hook really often, but... I'm gonna see if Yoichi has a fighting chance to at least get hatch. Damn, Booba came to play. They, they, they don't have a name. Oh no, did he find you? No. Ah. 
Damn. Oh, no, I hear it. Oh, he was so close. He was so close. It was right there. I don't know where he started, so. Damn. Like I said, Booba came to play. It became a game of altruism and nothing else. I mean, I ended up getting 6,000 points. I mean, I, you know what? People might get all upset about that, how that game went, but I think Bubba played well. What was he playing with? Main Residence, Discordance. He had barbecue, yep. Jolt. He didn't need no gen slowdown. We didn't even get to touch a gen. <laughs> he didn't even need those perks. I D pipped. No. See, I got five thousand points almost from altruism, and that was it. I had to get points somewhere. All right. Well, good job, Booba. You had our number. See, I ain't gonna get mad over that. I ain't gonna get mad over that. That's just one of those games that doesn't go the survivor's way, and the booba owned us. Um, I'm gonna stick my keep my build on. It's not what I'm used to, but we're still gonna try and attempt to get this challenge done today. Um. Uh... Let's put this on. Yeah. Oh, wait, do I want this? Put some repair speed. I think this is my, yeah, this is my last brown toolbox. It just be one of them days. Wait, is my, my, my thing is not running with the spoopy charms. It's spoopy season! I have to wear last year's spoopy charms. Man, the first match of the day was so deceiving of how the fog was going to be. <laughs> we played against the Ghostface, who played well. Who played well? I think he ended up... No, we only ended up getting two kills, but... We finished our hatch challenge that we've been working on for, like, a week. Or at least all last week, almost. Got that done in one try. Double pipped! And it hasn't been like that since. Well, the second match wasn't a bad, I don't think, was it? I don't remember what the second match was, but ever since, we've either just had rough matches or a little bit of camping killers. But yeah, the first match did not set me up for what today was going to bring. I'm super squirmy today. My VTuber keeps getting all out of whack. No, not the meat plants. All right, I am not going to do the first gen. I see I'm going down here. This is a good map, though, for pallets. 
We want to try and get our four studs in. Oh, it's a pig! Oh no, let's see if we can boop the snoot. I think that's Jigsaw over there. I can see him through the cage. I will, like, go on my first hook to see if the pig will let me boop or snoot. Piggy we played against it was a very nice killer and we obeyed everything she said she said no you can't have the Leon and Claudette I think it was because they I don't know if they didn't boot the snooze she said they were rude players but I'm gonna take rude as no boops I don't know where she is, though. Yeah, it is pig. Oh. Chris said this way. Oh. AFK? I don't know if she's gonna if she's AFK, but I booped her. Boop. Alright, well, I'm considering that a boop of the snoot. Chris just came over and said, hey, come here. Come look. AFK killer. Alright, well, that gives me some chances to possibly go around and do some stuff. Did she start moving, or am I just over her now? Alright, I'll do some gens now. That was really nice of Chris! Hi, Meg. I bet you really hammed it up! <laughs> they're AFK. Well, I might not be sad in a minute. They might come back to their screen. But this is a really good map to stun killer at if you can actually do it. And I was hoping if it was a piggy that was nice I could get her Chris. I could get her to um, follow me and boop snoots. Do you know where another one is? This one done? Ah, this one's not done. Alright. Oh, they... <laughs> then they ended up DC. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna chalk it up to computer... Not computer, uh, internet? Um, well... GG! <laughs> they had Zanson intact. Zanson tactics on impact. Uh, blood flavor. Oh, they had blood flavor! That wasn't gonna work well for me. Make your choice and iron grasp. Must have just had a problem with their internet, I'm gonna say. They brought Swan! Oh well. GG! GG's to the Chris for telling me to come here to see that Piggy was AFK. And then GG's to everyone else who got a couple gens done before the DC popped in. We'll count it nonetheless. Whether it was internet or not, doesn't matter. We'll still count it. Um, I want to spend a couple points on... Let's go put on Rebecca because she's actually got a little bit in her blood web. So they need to get uh, their perks unlocked. I need. 
need to put more into Ada, I think, though, because I think she has less of the universal perks unlocked. Even 15 sounds about right. Alright, alright, alright. Piggy D seed. Ooh, that means we survived with this, so let's go. Oops. Wrong program. Is rank reset Wednesday or is rank reset Thursday? Oh, it's Thursday. So we have, yeah. I started to, oh yeah, today's the 10th. Sorry. I can't math. It's okay. I started to actually uh, rethink of what I said earlier, but yeah. We have one more day with, uh, with this ranking system. Or not ranking system, but this cycle. I haven't played Addy in a while. But I am so looking forward to the Halloween event. If you guys weren't here at the beginning of stream, this week we won't be doing um, variety because the DVD Halloween event starts on Thursday. And normally I don't like to check it out um, off stream. I like to check it out on stream with you all. So... I don't want to wait till Monday to check it out. So we're going to be streaming DVD on Friday. And then the next week, I think, is when I'll put into effect um, tr uh, try out for a new schedule. Or not new schedule, but change. I was going to do it this week, but then I don't want to wait till Saturday to uh, do the Halloween event. So next week, we will do a Monday, Wednesday, Saturday stream to see... What if I can get myself into a habit of that and see if that'll work better? That way I won't miss as many um, Friday streams. I'll miss all Friday streams and we'll play on Saturday instead. And then possibly at the same time I will switch maybe Variety to Monday. Because not much goes on Mondays with DBD. Well, not much goes on on Saturday either, but... I feel like... When things go into effect and DBD is usually on Tuesdays... Or Wednesdays, so I would stream DVD always on Wednesday, and then we'd have also Saturday to play with it some more. And I'll have to wait till the following Monday. Oh, no worries, no worries, Brad. It's all okay. We always remember life comes first. Always remember life comes first. It's a nurse. I don't know where she blinked to, but I lost her terror radius. But yeah, if, if the DVD event wasn't starting on Thursday, I would have pushed back stream to Saturday and tried out a new schedule. Or not new, it's just changed from Friday to Saturday. But I don't want to wait. I want to play the Halloween event freaking as soon as possible, ma'am. Trying to get a stun in on the nurse is not possible. I feel bad. I think this is a newer nurse. <laughs> I 
coming. She's newer. Which, oh, believe me, nurse is hard. Hi, Blossom. How are you doing? I know if I'm here Wednesday, it'll be super late. My heart doctor appointment is at 2 p.m. Ooh, a little flashlight. Let's see. So that would be 11. Yeah, so you'd be a little bit late, yeah. Which is no problem. It's like... What was that? No problem. Always remember you come first and everything. It's okay. There's VODs to watch if you want to watch. If not, I got this. I can do it. Well, we have magic as well. And Blossom, she's available. But we can do this! Thank you, Brad, for giving Blossom a shout out. Oh no, I'm not feeling very well today, but I'm here on launch. Oh, sorry, not paying attention, sorry. I'm sorry you're not feeling well today. That's not good. Uh, we hope you start feeling better. Like, are you feeling bad, like, like tummy issues or. Are you still suffering from like your cold or whatever you had? Yeah, she's definitely gonna go back there. So I'm gonna get her first. Oops, sorry. That'll grab her attention. Or not. Damn! It was supposed to grab her attention. I don't want him going to second hook. <laughs> I don't know where another hook is, but... This nurse is not gonna like me one bit. She finally got me! Let's go! <laughs> I ran her so long at the beginning. I'm so proud of her! I saved the Nia. I deserved that hook. I'm proud of her. birthday not feeling well means calling sick exactly oof thank you guys so much for all the shout outs trying to keep up with chat you're very welcome I hope you're having the best birthday ever I'm sorry. I didn't know you were over there. She's starting to get the hang of it. I'm proud of her. I tis be proud. She's getting the hang of it. Uh, I don't really know where another gen is. 
That's not done. Let's do this. Oh, I made dinner last night and weirdly got the chills and aches and sore throat. No. I'm so sorry. I was watching a streamer last night that did that. Like, big time partner and streamer. Like, he was just streaming and all of a sudden kind of the same thing. He just got, like, really sick really fast. He played, like, one more match of DBD and then he ended. Thank you, Blossom, so much for getting Parada shout out as well. Ah! Do I have any means necessary so I can pick up this pallet? <laughs> Trying to get over here. Oh, it's God pallet too. You're right there, Steve. Oh, someone was here. I'm so glad you did. I was lurking around in stream yesterday. I was working on some things in the background. But I was there and I was a lurking. Oh no, I don't know where the gens are. I'm glad you had a good day yesterday. And I'm so sorry though you got sick though very soon after. We've kind of three gend ourselves. I think this gen, the one over there. And there's one in the building I think's not done. I think that's what's going on. Yay! Oh, she freaking scared me, sorry. <laughs> I love when you're there. Yes, I was there. I just didn't chat. Because I was working on things in the background. And it just be one of them days not really in the talkative mood. But I was there lurking and watching. Oof. Oh, I'm out of toolbox, damn. I was getting ready to sabo that, but I'm out. Uh, sadly, I don't think we're gonna get out of this match because we've got a kind of an not great three gen going. We have this one, that one that's very close, and then we have the one in the main. Clyde's playing a good game though. Yeah, I can't. I can't do nothing. I have no, no tin left in my toolbox. Is this, um... No. Shaking her head, no? Or if they were, that's just what they were doing, like they just had their hand like on the mouse or something. It looks like she was shaking, no, though, to me. It's okay, Claudette. You don't have to save me, it's okay. Rude. <laughs> I want Claudette to live. She's been playing a really good game. And 
again, no offense to the Claudette, I don't think I'd be able to get there for a save! <laughs> I don't want the pressure to be on me. Uh, let me see if I can get over here to this box. And hope it's a med kit. Because I don't think, um... I'm gonna be able to finish a gen solo. None of them are that close. <gasps> it's a med kit. Alright, I'm gonna heal myself up on top of this hill. Oh, damn. <laughs> No, nurse! I got heals! Leave me alone! I got this, I got this. I don't got this. Where the hell is she taking her? Med kit for the save! Be free! Oh! <laughs> she scared me! She actually popped up in front of me. Nope. Nope. I can't get a stun in, which is unfortunate, but... No! Nurse, keep following me! Nurse, come back! Leave Claudette alone! I'm gonna go back and reset this pallet. <laughs> uh, reset. Oh, Blossom, thank you so much for making Sally dance and sip sip! Can do, just one moment. No, you're across the map! I got the one save. I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it over there again. She's not picking up either, so she's going for the slug. Let me get some coffee real quick. Unless I can catch her exhausted. pickup though. I was damn proud of that pickup. Alright, let me get my sip sips in real quick. I need it! I need it! This is a match! Ah, thank you so much for the sip sips, Blossom. I can't believe I got her picked up though. I was waiting for her to hopefully swing or hit me. She would have to have a cooldown. Pick up the Claudette! Block her! And then hopefully go down for her, but... Unfortunately, that's what happened, but unfortunately she didn't pick me up. Unfortunately, she didn't pick me up, so I'm just going to kind of crawl around. No! Claudette! I was really, really, really hoping she would pick me up. Or I'm not going to bleed out anytime soon, but I was really hoping that she would get Hatch. <gasps> Did she have DS? She got off. Let's go.
Damn, this Claudette player, though, is really good. I'm trying to get myself over here that maybe if something happens, Hatch will spawn over here. But they're only on, it's not going to happen. They're only on their second hook, so. you know I was way over here <laughs> oh come on just pick me up you can't see the nurse cuz I'm blocking her if she was going to give me hatch. Oh. I hate listening to the sound like a hundred times, but... <laughs> let's see. Let's see if she gives me hatch. She could close it on my face, too. to escape through hatch it's not letting me <laughs> i thought she was gonna like hover over and be like ha, 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 here it is and now i'm gonna hook you but she actually gave me hatch that was nice of her that was very nice of her super pop yt want a match though want a match i was just getting ready to say when she did that, I'm like, oh no, she's gonna go over hatch and then, or put me on hatch and then close it. But then she didn't, and then I thought she was gonna hook me right there at the end. Well, thank you for hatch nurse. <laughs> Who was that? That was the, that was Claudette. Man, you played well. That Claudette played so well. It was a fight there for the end. I was hoping that the Claudette would actually get hatch, but it ended up being a very, very nice nurse in the end. And she played well. I figured they were kind of learning nurse. But as the match started going on, they were really getting the hang of her, I think, because it was getting harder to run against her. But they did good. And it was fun. I, didn't, I have not stunned the killer, I don't think, once today. Okay, time for med kits, because I'm out of toolboxes. Um... Let's just put this one. <gasps> Sup supper. Sorry. <laughs> super pup. Is it super pup whitey? I'm assuming. GGWP, same to you. Thank you so much for hatch. GWP forming has resubscribed for three months. JW, thank you so much for the resub for three months as well. How are you doing? Uh, thank you so much for that. But GG and WP to you too, super pup. That was a fun match. Um... Thank you so much for Hatch. I thought you were going to tease me with it at first. I really did. When you hovered over Hatch and then went over toward the hook, I'm like, no! <laughs> They're teasing me! To my world, bitch. And then you gave me Hatch and I was like, oh, that was super sweet of them. <laughs> it was fun, though. I had a lot of fun. And Super Pup, thank you so much for uh, the follow and welcome on into Skelly Town. You were good. You were a good nurse. Were you just learning nurse? Or are you getting used to nurse? Because you're, if you are getting used to her, you are starting to really get the hang of it right there at the end. Because I started, I even said during the match, as I was running, I was like, oh no! No, they're getting good! I can't run it, boy. I'm good, you're so very good. Thank you so much for asking. I'm glad you're doing good too, JW. It's been a good 
good day in the fog. We've had some interesting matches. Like, we've had a couple people camp and tunnel. But, I mean, it's right before rank reset. You kind of get it. You kind of get used to it when it's that time of the month. <laughs> but it's been a fun day in the fog. Um, I'm back up to pip three pips into three. I started my day with a double pip match. And I've kind of stuck around the same rank all day. That three gen though, I know! I saw it! I was like, I, I didn't realize we three gen ourselves until... Uh, the first person died, I think it was. And then I realized what three gens we had, and I was like, oh no, we're not gonna be, it, someone's gonna, or not someone, but only one of us is getting out of this match, because I did not think that all we were gonna ever be able to finish one of those gens against the nurse. Because I saw it, and it's like, nope, 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 nope. Getting used to her? She's hard, I understand, I'm the same, I don't play her often. And she's very hard to get used to. But I could tell at the beginning of the match you were you were getting used to her, and then by mid-match, you were getting the hang of it. You were getting the hang of it. And I play her too sometimes, so I know. I know how that is. But you were getting really good. Cause I'm the same I, I only play nurse. Cause normally how I play is if I survive against a nurse, I will go play. Usually before rank reset, I don't play a lot of killer. So I don't play Nurse often. And I can't play her without, I think it's the plaid flannel add-on, I think it is, to show where her blinks are. I cannot play her without those because I have no idea where I'd be going without them. Why does this music sound Christmassy? It's Halloween, no. Yeah, it's not that Christmassy. But nonetheless, GG, it was really fun to play against you. And if you keep uh, practicing at her, keep it up. You'll 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 get her. I noticed. Were you console? I think I noticed you were console, or at least not Steam. Because what I noticed as a PC player, I play on controller, but. I've noticed uh, if I play nurse without controller, oh my god, she's so much easier. Doesn't make me good at her at all, but she's easier to play without a controller. That's a wall. Huntress? I'm not gonna go for that. Frickin' nemesis. <laughs> he actually scared me. Did I get that stun? I wasn't paying attention. Let me just go right the wrong over here. Oh, this wasn't my palette. Pick this up. You're on Xbox. Okay. I, I thought I remember seeing the uh, console icon, but I wasn't sure. Yeah, playing nurse on controller is definitely hard. Uh, and I, I, I normally play on controller because that's just how I play. I like to play on controller. But my community made me play on keyboard once and they picked nurse. And I actually enjoyed the match a lot more than I normally would on my mouse, or on my controller. She was a little bit more easier to control. Still didn't make me good at her, still didn't make me enjoy playing as her, but it was easier. But if, if you play as her enough, you get kind of used to how the blinks work, how to time them, and all that. 
I mean, I, this is coming from advice from someone who barely plays her, but... <laughs> I noticed when I had to play her a couple times, the more you get in, the more easier it gets. And in a way, she's kind of fun. I think he broke that pallet that I threw. Is it this one? Or here? so much for giving me JW a shout out. I heard this noise in my ears and I thought it wasn't the game. Now I have a hugging 30 minutes. But for me, I can't hear with the shout out clips very well. If you never fixed it so I can hear him. Trying to find a gen that's not done in this general area. I'll go across the map. Oh no! I'm near. Wait. How did she go down? Oh no! Did a zombie get her? Rude. around would you like the heels oh there she is she was in a locker I guess I'll go back to the gen I was working on. I'm not feeling the boons, so I'm going to take out all the totems. <gasps> nice! Well, welcome back, Brad. Get rid of that. Not the eruption! I got this totem, I guess. Oh, that's right! I can't do nothing! Damn it, I gotta wait. This is my totem, though. Nobody touch it. You want it? We got a few more seconds until... Here, he's coming. I'll run him away. Yes, this way, in the main, this way. I think, I don't know, I didn't notice if I heard tier two or not. Oh. Bye! Where'd he go? This zombie has eyes for only me. Did someone get, yes. Frick! All right, back to this gen. Oh, Jesus. I don't know why the zombies are coming out of nowhere. I think, uh, I think he broke the pallet over here, so I'm not gonna be able to do this gen. Or, <laughs> do this gen. Send this zombie. Damn it, there's two of them. There are two zombies over here! Camp in my gens! I'll just go back and forth, I guess. 
Because all the pallets are gone and I don't have a flashlight. Why it doesn't commit to a chase, I will not know. <laughs> Alright, are those two zombies still camping out those two gens I was working on? No, oh, he's over here now. This is when I love any means necessary. If there was a pallet, I could stun the zombie and just pick up the pallet. What? Jeez, ma'am! Sally! You need to get lost. I can't get nothing done. I am being haunted by the only two zombies on this map. is not anything against anybody. It's just I can't get nothing done. Let's hope he doesn't have like awakened awareness and sees me back here. Hey! We got the gen done finally. Run! Run! your tentacle. I got stuck on a rock. I tried to do a 360 back for the pallet and then I decided not to go for the pallet so I was trying to do a 360 turn around. Cheryl. Oh no, I've got an employee of the month here. Employee of the month. All right. Uh, thank you, Cheryl. You are amazing. I am out of med kit though. Alright, I got you. You save me, I save you. Of course. Of course! When I decide to get off a of gen, a skill check pops up. They pop up no other time except for when my brain's like, I'm getting off this gen. Then the skill check is like, I got you. Freaking zombies! I have never had this much problems with zombies before! Oh no. Was this basement? No. All right, well, I'm close. Oh, 
Honestly, I have no idea where Ada is. I have not seen her very much. Thank you, Cheryl. Ow! I feel like extra... Yeah, I did that for you, Cheryl. I've got a hook to spare. It's okay. Uh, I feel like I have to extra concentrate today. I don't know why. It's just been kind of one of them days. Especially since I have no luck in this match against these zombies. Ah, oh, so close. I have had no luck versus these zombies in this match. No clue where he went. I thought he was going to loop right back around for us. Don't worry, Ada. I'll distract him. Well, I distracted him. But Ada was following, so it wasn't a very good distraction. You got the Cheryl. You got the. Oh, you went the other way, Dan. Oh, sorry. Nope, sorry. That was my bad. Save yourself, Cheryl! Trying to get his attention over here! Yeah, let's go! I have nothing over here to. So I'm just gonna let him put me on my last hook and hopefully Cheryl will catch. Injured with nowhere to run! When you're injured and nowhere to run, it's not giving up, but you know what? I would rather other people survive than me, so. I feel like the match was good enough to at least pip. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Bum, bum, bum. I went the wrong way. Yeah, I at least pipped, so that's okay. Let's see if she gets hatch. Oh, no! He's right behind her! If she... <laughs> I was gonna say, if she gets lucky, she probably could outrun him, but I, she's not trying that hard. It doesn't look like. Well, damn. Nemi played a really good game, though. He played a really good game. I think what hit hurt me the most was his damn zombies. Oh, I hear Hatch. Oh, no. 
Hatch was near um, the building. Hatch was somewhere near that building. She was close. Oh well. That, but the zombies got me more than anything that game because I couldn't stay on a couple of the gens that were left. And because of that, I couldn't get anything done other than just running around saving people. Your uncle's lawyer. That's who we're playing against. Uh, ah, oh, they had Noah! Damn! Wait. No. Um, I was thinking all the totems might have been gone, but I don't think so. And I think he didn't he didn't hit her at la at the last. No, the zombie hit her. That's right. They had no wet. I was taking out totems too. I was taking out totems. I left a few cuz um I had to do other things, but I was taking out totems trying to prevent the no wet. Just a rough match. Just a rough match. Employees of the month. I have need one more pip. I am just not. I don't think I've stunned a killer at all today. I don't think I've stunned one killer today. Let alone get four in a match. The only reason I'm gonna keep this challenge on is because it's the last one in the current tome. I could go work on some old tomes, get some BP, but I don't necessarily need it. So I'm gonna see if I can get lucky and maybe get a match that either I'll have some luck and get some stuns in or possibly someone who will let me stun them. Big Macs are life. <laughs> I mean, I prefer like the cheeseburgers, but ain't wrong. Hi, Chuck. How's the fog been treating you today? Not bad, but it's definitely been a struggle. We'll put it that way. How are you doing today, Chuck? How has everything been going? Baby doing good still? Wife doing good? But yeah, the, the fog today, it's been good, but... I started my day with no pips into gold three, and I'm only four pips in, and I've been streaming for our three and a half hours. And we double pipped our first match. And I've played no killer. So that kind of shows you how the fog's going. <laughs> but they're not necessarily bad matches. Just some either bad luck or a couple campers and so on. Yeah, I played a bit earlier in both sides, Killer and Survivor. Just have some really spicy people. Yeah. Yeah. That's the reason I'm not playing Killer today. Killer matches, I've noticed when it's right before rank reset, I enjoy the least. Like, I don't want to play. And I was watching a streamer play Killer before I started and she was getting a lot of spicy people you know so it kind of told me right there what was out there possibly I didn't want to come across and then on the survivor side I haven't necessarily had very many bad survivors as teammates I've actually had a lot of great teammates but the killers have definitely been a little spicy we've had a couple campers couple tunnelers couple camping tunnelers Last match actually wasn't bad. The Nemi played well. His freaking zombies would not leave me alone. Every time I tried to work on these two gens, these two zombies were always there. And I ended up having to go do other things and I didn't know where the third gen was. Just employees of the months. BB is doing good. Just very fussy. Well, I'm sorry they're fussy, but I'm glad they're doing good nonetheless. But babies be fussy, yeah. Right before rank reset, and right after are always the worst, yep. I always take it, like, if it's right before or even right after, I wait until I get into the fog to judge. Because I have actually had some times before and after where I've had amazing days. Like, a lot of fun, you know, no complaints, ranking up pretty well. But I will definitely say more times than none. You get spicy right before and after. That is, like I said, that's the reason I'm not playing killer. It's because um, I get kind of flustered playing killer when you start getting people getting sweaty for this for rank reset. And being extra spicy, so I decided I did not want that today. And I'm also trying to get up as high, I can, high as I can um, for my survivor rank. 
because I'm safe by remain. I'd rather get my ranking up than that. But yeah, three and a half hours of game, double pipped first match, still in the same rank. That's pretty much the telltale. I want this totem. I saw Claudette there, so I was hoping she was going to run the opposite way. If she wasn't, I was going to try and loop back around. But yeah, when I double pipped on my first match and finally got my hatch challenge done, I was like, this is going to be a good day. It's going to be... It, it's just going to be good. We're going to have some good luck. Um, and that was about it. <laughs> that was the last like really good game I had. But again, the last match actually wasn't bad. It was a really good game. Just the zombies kicked my ass more than anything. I have one... Uh, stun. I need three more. <laughs> I've also got the challenge on to stun four killers in a match. I don't think I'm gonna get it, but I'm gonna try my best. Here you go. So I'm trying to stay kind of around areas that have uh pallets. Plus so today I'm actually running um. A build I'm not used to, which it's not very difficult build though, but it's a build specific for <laughs> No I wanted the triple blind blind triple palette. Oh, he's gonna get me here. Woo! Sir. Oh, no! That's not what I want! <laughs> I was slow. I slowly got out of the pallet. Out of the pallet. I was looking at that pallet over there. I slowly got out of the locker when I wanted to X out fast. It's okay. I don't mind hanging out here. I went up my pallet stud though! Now I gotta go somewhere. There's a pallet over there. I could pick back up. I was trying to do, hopefully, the triple pallet stun there that Denny was telling me about, but he said no. He said no, I'm breaking this pallet. I'm being healed by Big Macs or life. You're gonna make you're gonna tear my backpack. <laughs> Trying to get the healing done before uh sloppy butcher sloppy butcher? Yeah, it takes over much more of my life! do that on purpose. <laughs> they missed a skill check against me. That was just funny that I actually missed a skill check on them. 
Go. Go. There's no pallets, so... though. I know why. <laughs> he took me to basement? I'm not going to basement for my sins? Because I sinned. Oh, I swear I was going to basement there. Wow, okay. Don't worry, I'm just being dumb. Don't worry about me. I need to get that dumb sticker to put on my VTuber when I have one of those dumb moments in this game. It'll be my punishment. What do we got going on here? Where is everybody? One, two... Uh, fourth person is missing. Or hiding within a... Within a yellow blob already. I don't know where the fourth person is. In a locker! Okay. I mean, I was in a locker too, but I was trolling. <laughs> no, I missed Claudette! Oh, thank you! Claudette! Oh, Claudette's got a really bad pig! Oh, wait, what is going on? I'm not dead! Okay. <laughs> Did the DVD crash? That was the weirdest thing ever. All right, let's put some music on. Oh, it was me and the killer got DC'd. Oh, it must have been Steam. Me and the killer DC'd because um, nobody else did. Did Steam go down? That was so weird, though. I missed my skill check. Claudette got there, and all of a sudden, she's just skating across the wall. And I'm like, wait. Is she, like, I thought she was going to like disconnect a, from a ping or something. And then I looked, and I noticed I was dead, technically, but still struggling. But me and the killer DC'd and we were the only two on PC. So I think Steam went down. Okay. Well, GG's. Sorry to all our console players. Well, I'm still here though. It didn't push me back to the main menu. That was weird. Um, all right, continuing on. I'll count that as a as a uh, blight got me, because I probably was gonna die. I don't know if the Claudette actually got there before uh, the the server went down. Hi, um, I was the killer. Don't know what happened. Don't know if it had my Wi-Fi. No, I got DC'd as well. Or someone else's, but the last thing was happened was I was struck. Stop grabbing the detective top off the gen! <laughs> then I got a message saying I was disconnected. I think the online servers for PC went down, because I was disconnected too. It was so weird. I was on hook. Um, I had a sliver of life left. Claudette got there, and all of a sudden, she's just, like, skating across the wall. And she's, like, in a corner, just running. And then I was still struggling, but it said I was dead.
and then I was disconnected. So I think the online servers for PC went down. I thought it was Steam, because I was considered disconnected as well. But GG's, you are doing really well. You are doing really well. I was having fun. And um, yeah, I, I just, I noticed in the end game, me and you were disconnected, but all the console players considered uh, they were still in the match, so. I have to go back and watch the end of that match because I thought I was dead. Because I missed a skill check as Claudette was coming to get me. And I didn't think she was going to get there. She got there and I'm like, yes, she just made it. And then she just skates on by me. Like, I'm like, Claudette, hello, I'm dying here. Then all of a sudden I was disconnected. I was like, oh, hmm. thanks, Claudette. She might have made it. I don't know. I'm counting it as you got a kill because I think I was dead. But it happens, it happens. DCs happen. But yeah, I think it had something to do with the PC. Steam, PC, or something. Because like I said, endgame chat showed me and you DC'd, but nobody else did. Alright. But nonetheless, you are doing awesome. I was trying to get stuns in. I have my challenge on for four stuns in a match. So I was trying really hard. When I finally got the first one, I was like, yes, I've got this. I can get three more, maybe. So then I started kind of concentrating on that more. Oh, hi, May. Corrupt! How dare you! Who plays with corrupt in this economy? Lots of killers. It's a nemesis because there's a stupid zombie. <laughs> Thank you. Oops. I mean, Blight have been for months. I've gotten super good. You are good. You can tell when there's killers like Blight, Nerds, those killers that are harder to run against. You can tell when you get someone who knows what they're doing in as practice. Hmm. I was gonna throw that, but I don't want to. Yeah, it's a boon. Wish I could have continued, but oh well, I had fun anyway, same. I wish we could have continued too. I think I was gonna die, but I don't know if the Claudette was gonna make it, but I was fine with it. You were playing really well. I have no complaints. It just sucks when that happens, when you're having a good game, and then... It ends not on your terms by meaning DC. Will we go get to play together again? Hopefully soon. I don't necessarily, like I said, I just don't like necessarily playing with people on stream. Cause I like the entertainment of solo queue. I wanna play more off stream. I just haven't recently cause I haven't been in the mood to play off stream if it's not killer. But the temperatures are finally cool. I can play on my computers longer. My computers. My computer longer. I don't have to worry about my room being 500 degrees and I'm baking to death. <laughs> I missed doing the PTB, which I regret because I wanted to see the new Mori system and stuff. I actually didn't participate in this PTB because of the Mori system. I saw enough of it from other people that I did not want to see it anymore for myself. Welcome to my world, bitch. No, I missed the last one! Oh, I was concentrating so hard on that. Concentrate so hard. Shay Evelyn, that's a beautiful name, by the way. Thank you so much for the follow. And welcome on in, Skeletown. Ah, okay, I got finished. I was concentrating so hard, and then it bugged me that I missed the last one. I think. Is there a totem in here? No. But yeah, the same. I didn't participate in the PTB because I didn't really want to see the new Mori system after I had already seen it. 
from others and I was kind of like over over it but I did miss participating in the P2B in general because they're a lot of fun but I've noticed mid chapters aren't quite as fun as new chapters anyways good to hear the compliments you seem you seem great at Survivor yourself I wish you the best on your next matches and stream as well GG please again enjoy the follow well thank you you were amazing and thank you so much for the compliments as well I don't find that I'm really that good at Survivor, but I do made it. So it's always good to hear when someone thinks that I, I did pretty good. <laughs> but thank you, you did amazing as Bly, and keep up the amazing work. It was a lot of fun, just unfortunate that something happened to disconnect us both. And again, thank you so much for the follow, and welcome in, and hope you have fun in the fog! I am looking so forward to the Halloween event. I mean, I'm all about Halloween. And I participated in last year's, and it was a blast. So I'm looking really forward to participating in this year's. So much so that um, I'm streaming DVD on Friday instead of a variety game. You did not just run him over here. I'm going to have to give up on that. He's going to hit me no matter what. I hated doing that, but hey, got rid of Merciless Storm, though. <laughs> I'm not going to stream a variety game on Friday because I can't wait until Monday to play the events. And I don't like to s do it not on stream because I like to do it on stream with you guys because this is my main game. So I like to make sure uh, everything I'm doing with DVD for the first time is on stream. So Friday we'll be streaming DVD so we can check out the main, the main event. The Halloween event. I want to have this basement, but I don't know where he is. And then as I put on the Discord, um, pretty soon, probably next week, I'm going to be testing out streaming on Saturday instead of Fridays. And I was going to do it this week, but I don't want to miss the Halloween event. There is a booner, but I think we'll be okay with this one being gone. But what am I our things last year about the event other than all the prize prizes and stuff I mean like charms and all that was the smashing of the pumpkins I absolutely loved going around smashing the pumpkins last year even if I didn't have to and I'm so looking forward to getting back into the matches and just kicking pumpkins but also there's something new called like an energy thing. Um, I'm kind of anxious to see how it works. Where the hell is the gate? I thought it was on this wall. I swear the gate was right there and I ran the entire wall. I'll get rid of this totem though. I know there was one back over there, but I thought they were over there kind of guarding it. Is it over here? Oh, here it is! Alright, I got you, Meg. <laughs> Where's everybody else? pick it up yet <laughs> it's still on cooldown 
I'll pick it up when it's uncool. And it's a hot perk. Can I? Nope, I have a med kit. I was gonna stab out this hook. I wanna pick it up again. I should leave. I always feel bad staying behind, but I'm trying to get points. Is there a totem in here? Ah, I looked already. <coughs> All right, I'll leave. Fine. I wanted to pick up the pallet again. I wanted to pick up the pallet again. And I had a little tiny bit left in my cooldown of any means necessary, but everybody else left, so I ain't gonna be that person and stick around. Uh, Juju Double P. Bloodhound, corrupt, lethal. Yeah, merciless storm. I felt that one. <laughs> they brought a flaw on, flaw on you. I lost him a couple times. But I don't know if it's because of my lightweight. I'm not going to say it is, but I kept I keep losing killers a little more than I usually do. And I'm wondering if it is because of that perk. Because I know when I'm playing killer and I get someone with lightweight and the scratch marks are... Not all over the place, but they're a little harder to follow. Oh, now I've been lost completely. Um, uh, but, 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 but let's get rid of this centibite one. No, not another killer. It is a lot easier to lose a survivor, is what I was trying to say. Um, ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum. this build is fun. It's not my normal build. It's not getting me pallet stuns, but it's just because I'm not getting killers that are falling for the pallets. That's my only thing. Like, I'm enjoying it. It's kind of fun to run to be different. But I'm just not getting uh, the opportunities, really, to hit p uh, killers with pallets. I don't know if I've ever asked you, Chuck, but how long have you been playing DBD? I feel like I asked once, but I don't remember. <laughs> GG, that was a teabagging thing. Well, GG's to you as well. <laughs> I had fun with you at the end. <laughs> I wanted to pick up the pallet again, but I was waiting for my any means necessary to um, come back. It was on cooldown. And that's the only reason I went over there, threw the pallet, and picked it up is because I just wanted to get some extra points to use the perk. And I was going to do it again, but I just, it had cool down, so I had to wait. But I had fun right there at the end with you. <laughs> and then right as everybody left, my perk almost was ready to use again, and I just, I left instead. <laughs> You're good, I didn't know there was a cool down. I actually didn't know it was that long, if I'm being completely honest. Uh, it has a 60 second cooldown. I thought it was a lot shorter than that, because I was going to pick it up again. But no, it, it has a 60 second cooldown, and I didn't know it was that long. I love to see if, the, if they needed help at the other door. I was actually gonna run that way, um, but then as I was gonna do that, because I went to look in the house, or no, that little outhouse right there to see if there was a totem in there to take it out. Uh, and then everybody escaped, so then I was like, oh, well, I'll just leave, because I hadn't gotten to run that far yet. <laughs> need, need these cooldowns, no. <laughs> yeah, right. All right. Have good games, friends. Same to you. Have fun in the fog today. You were fun to play with. I enjoyed our match. Thank you for the tea bags at the end, and thank you for throwing the palette. I was gonna pick it up. For the damn cooldown. Like I said, I thought it was like a forty-second cooldown for some reason. So I was like, I got this. I'll wait a few seconds and then I'll grab it again. Freaking sixty seconds. I 99 the other door, which is why I was like, oh, okay, nice. Nice. Anyways, have a good game. Same to you. I have an amazing time in the fog. I do the same, though. I 99 doors, and then I try and see where everybody is. But um, right there at the end, I was having too much fun with you, so I didn't, <laughs> I didn't go look for looking for anybody. I was not hoping, but I was waiting to see if they ended up downing someone so I could see where they're at, and then I would run that way. But it didn't happen, so I didn't do that. 
back at this map, though. Let's see, the lights are flexing. So I think Solo Gen is in here. Is this Solo Gen always here? No, I think I've seen it not here before. I feel like every time we get on this map lately, though, it's always Solo Gen. Bobby Mommy! Again? Okay. Oh, I see the pallet down. Ma'am! Should probably go back and grab that pallet, though. Sorry, <clears throat> I thought it was closer. There you go, be free! Again, I have a med kit with a... Vami Mommy. I don't know if she's coming up here. I don't wanna get stuck in this room. Every time, though, I keep getting vomi mommies. I, it's the one time I bring a med kit. Did I pip that match? Did anyone notice? I wasn't paying attention. I wanted to see if I finally hit uh, gold two. Anna makes solo gen so long. Don't worry, Claudette, I got this one. Just let me know she's coming. I wouldn't want to be in this room anymore anyways. I've thrown up a lot in here. It's probably not a very pleasant place to be. All right, solo gen. Uh, done. Damn, that was the first gen done, too. Our totem? No. I am not going to touch that gen with them because I am currently infected and they're not. So I'm going to let them finish that gen. I'm going to go see if I can find a gen... Is there probably one downstairs? Lights aren't blinking blinking, so... Leon! There's one down here, okay. Actually, really quickly, let me see if there is a box over here. There is, because I'd rather get rid of my med kit against a, uh, a nurse. A plague because it's useless. There's also a totem. Toolbox! Much better, much better. Oh my goodness, Leon, you're way over there? All right, let me see, let me see, let me see. I don't know where everybody went. <laughs> God, it's a worry. I ran all the way across the map for you, Leon. Woo! <laughs> Damn! I was way past that! 
definitely shouldn't go for Leon, that's all right. I probably could have gone a while, a little, a little bit farther, but I didn't notice Ada was right there, and I didn't want to get her, uh, get her in trouble. now I want to use. I have a really bad feeling I'm going to be stuck in this basement. Someone's making a run. I don't know who it is, so. I'll make it. Oh, never mind. Well, she still might make it, but she has been spotted. Never mind, she won't make it. <laughs> Where? Ah, oh, right above me. No, I'm gonna get a second hook. Oh, no. Hey, look, it's Jelly. Please, ma'am! I have been on second hook already! Um, let's see. Where do I go? Where do I go? Where do I go? Um, no, I'm not gonna- I don't wanna touch you. I don't wanna infect her, so... This is the stairs. I know it's kind of like a douche thing to do to just run by her, but I don't want to infect her. Oh, frick! I have to mend! Oh my gosh! I didn't even notice! I saw I got the hit, but it didn't even dawn on me. No, I'm- I'm broken. I'm broken. You can't heal me. I am beyond help. No offense, Ada. You should probably go for that. Thank you. You have a- you have lots of hooks to spare. Oh, they got him. Welcome back, Ada. <laughs> Though now she's got the cooties. All right. Where? Oh, there's a pallet down over here. Though let me go do some work. All right. I have no idea where another gen is. Claudette's dead. Ah, another gen. Trying to get at least one stud in. I want to go fish for challenge, but I was going to try and get wood.
All right, was it good enough to pip? It was good. That's the question today. Was it good enough to pip? Because our goal was to get to at least gold one today before end of stream. I've only got about half hour today. Thought it was maybe the same plague player. I don't think that was her name. No! I didn't pip that other match either. The nemesis one right before this one? Did I not just do enough? Because I thought that was a really good game. This one I thought I maybe could pip, but... Damn! I'm not even gonna... Well, I've got time, but not gonna get to where I wanted to. I mean, it's harder to pip once you get up in the higher ranks, for sure, but... I swear I would have done enough that last game. Not the plague one, but the nemesis one. To at least get a pip. At least I didn't deep pip. All right, all right. Oh, I forgot to change my offering, sorry. <laughs> so I used all my escape cakes. Oh, well. Not that big a deal. I just forgot to change my offering. Um, Let's use our last brown med kits. Let's put a little bit of points, actually, into Fang real quick. Then I'll use probably the rest on uh ba -ba -ba, Re probably Rebecca because she's closer to being um at least prestige too. I was hoping to find a lightweight level two soon, I didn't. I said I said I didn't get that pip. Oh yeah, that's right. Oh, my dailies are killer. I forget what rank I got as killer right now. I'll probably be where I stay. Cause like I said, I probably will play killer before rank reset or right after. Curious next month, when is the 13th? So next month it's on a Sunday. Okay, that's not too bad. Which means the day after we will get our points and everything. I think that's what I'll do from now on. Right, I, I won't play my normal way right before rank reset and then right after. We'll give it like a week. I think it'll be bedtime for me now. It's 2.30 so I should sleep. You should sleep, Denny. You should. Thank you so much for hanging out. If you do go to sleep, get lots of good sleeps, and I hope you really start feeling better very, very soon. But I always enjoy you hanging out here. It's always good to see you. And I hope you start feeling better tomorrow. For sure. Thank you, you're very welcome. And good night, and get lots and lots and lots of good sleeps, and I will hopefully see you around very soon. Most likely Wednesday. I am busy tomorrow, I know that for sure. Food 
bowl of chili with an error. Ooh. Well, at least a bowl of chili is not bad. Avocado toast with a side of fried inside. <laughs> I thought it was going to say french fries. I almost read it as french fries. Then I saw it said insects. Ew! Would you rather have the bowl of chili with um an error? <laughs> Alrighty, good night, good night, Denny. Thank you again so much for hanging out. Like I said, it's always good to see you. Feel better and get lots of good sleeps. Who is a doctor? Yeah, I saw where I was. <laughs> I was tested him. Why is it when I play doctors? Um, they always find me like in two seconds. Didn't get my stun, damn. Someone's over there, damn it. Sorry. Sorry, whoever was over there. Woo, no! Hey, run! Sorry! I thought it gave up on me. Damn it. Killers, let me stun you! Well, I'm going down here. Killers won't let me stun them! Thank you, Brad, for giving me magic a shout out. <laughs> Who was like that just went running by? Oh. Magic and joy. <laughs> yes, magic and joy. Enjoy that tasty, tasty food. Nice, Jane. Nice. Oh, he's coming. Thank you, Jane. Let me go. Uh, let me go see if someone's on this gen. If no one's on this gen, I'll heal myself. Oop, Fang's on the gen. Let's go. Ow! Ma'am! Again, I'm not doing anything to Pip. Ping. And he's got overcome or over overcome. Overcharge. Yes. thrown with any means necessary well not with any means necessary but it makes me just really want to get over there and pick the pallet up welcome to my world bitch Oregon thank you so much for the follow welcome on into Skelly Town you are the play glass match right Ah, it's got a giant on. 
Where'd he go? Thought he was gonna come over to the gen that popped, but he did not. He's right there. He's right there. Don't see me. I'm not here. I'm trying to get to you, Jade. Oh, never mind. Somebody beat me. Oh, okay. Well, um, I guess I'll go work on. I hear a jet. Oh, here it is. Frank and Kate scared me. Yes. Well, GG's to you in that last match. That was a fun match. I had fun. You played very well. You got this fag. I believe in you. <laughs> Sir, I am busy. Could you not? <laughs> I have got gens to do! See if this totem lights. Oh, nope, didn't light. Alright. I'm gonna take it out though for points. And, uh, let's see. I don't want Jane going for this unhook because she's on death hook. Kate's got that door. Oh dear, let me see if I can get over there. He'll probably see the Kate and go for her, so never mind, Jane got it. Let's go. Oh, and someone 99 the door over here. Nice. Oh, I see her. Where did the fang go? Even get this door to 99. Oh, there you are. Where, where did everyone go? Unless he has no ed. You got this bag! Run! I'm just gonna open the other door because it's open. Hopefully I stalled him long enough. Where Jane is, though. Resetting the palette. <laughs> I have a feeling Jane will be fine. I love when that happens. I love when I can body block a killer and hopefully... Like, take a hit for- He wouldn't even swing at me, though. He said, no, I want the fang. Well, I was the fang. The other fang. He probably could have got me down if he would have swung. Let's see where Jane is. Oh, she's good. Told you she'd be fine. Told you. I mean, I hate doing that because as a killer myself, when I play killer, oh, I cannot stand when survivors freaking get in my way trying to body block for other survivors. But as a survivor, I love doing it because my whole goal is to always help everybody. Overcharge, uh, monitor and abuse, barbecue. Oh, we had nurses! Oh, okay. Okay. Again, no stunts. These killers today, they are just like, no, you can't stun me. <laughs> Normally, though, I'm not very good at stunning killers anyway, so it's not that surprising, but... Giving that I'm trying a little harder today, yeah, it's not happening. 
Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Did I get anything else good in the blood web? Let's just put this last thing in to get rid of it. Let's go back to our toolbox. <gasps> Again! Not enough to piv! I'm so mad! <laughs> match I've had ever since I've gotten four pips in have been just enough to not pip or oh, d-pip I swear I cannot get this freaking last pip and I'm not even I don't really ever pay attention to the end game like I never not the end game but the end game stats page like I never look at it to see what did I do how close was I really and everything, I kind of just skim by it and go to the player's page. And I need to look because I need to see what am I not doing in my matches to get that. I didn't make really any saves, so my altruism wasn't there. So that's probably just it. I haven't been very altruistic the last few matches, and it's not by me not wanting to be. It's just me not being able to. Either someone beats me there, or... I'm injured or I'm on death hook, so I want someone else to go for it. You know what I mean? I think that's where I'm starting to um, not get my points from is my altruism. But I'm not looking either. That's just a guess. I don't look at the end game, so I don't know what I've not been doing. Now my goal, my goal today was to hit gold one. Ain't gonna happen. My goal now is to get this damn last pip. And if I de-pip, it's to get two more. But I've only got probably about half hour left. I can probably go till about 6.15. But overall, we've had a good day in the fog, nonetheless. It's been a good day. Oh, we have an ad rolling. And we're up to 785 followers. Oh, I pushed for this to go on and it didn't go through. <laughs> I must have misclicked. You better get it together and start pipping. I know. Oh, my, it's my, why did my thing not work? Oh, well. There was ads rolling. <laughs> hey, Midwitch. But my ads thing didn't work. I feel that. I need to get my shit together and start pipping here. Especially, like I said, we're running out of time. But I guess the positive, I'm not deep hipping. My bad, sorry. No, I'll, con I'll, I'll commit, sorry. That was my bad. I missed it by like two inches. I made the Kate right away. I want to pick them back up. Freaking hate double story maps. Never know if I should commit to a gen or not. Break! Oh. 
I wanted the second. Well, I ran him for a good while. I only heard the sweet pop of one gen, though. If I can hear two more pop here in a sec, ooh, I will love it. No! Get away from me! Alright, fine. You want some marshmallows? Here. I want us to get the sweet pop of a bunch more gens. We're roasting marshmallows! Does anybody want any? Wait, we're on a camping trip with Blight. I got my I got my fire going and my marshmallows toasted. though that I didn't hear more gens pop as I was running because that's always such a sweet sound let's go yeah it's because he'll definitely tunnel me now All I can do is camp pallets. You, sir, are supposed to get hit by those. Marshmallows out if you want some more. I didn't have time to put them away. Let's go! I ran him the entire match! They got all five gens done by the time he could catch me twice. Y'all, open the door. Don't bother with me. Open the doors. Because this is actually a map that's really hard. I still got my marshmallows. Hi, welcome back. All right, let's open the door. You guys are freaking amazing. This is an awesome team. That 
That was a freaking awesome team. Let me put my marshmallows away. Sorry. I'm done. <laughs> I ate all my marshmallows. I got camped. I got tuttled. They got all five gens done. And got me off the hook and I survived. Not enough to pip again, though. But that's okay because I didn't do jittily squat that match because of that. I had, and hopefully everybody else gets out. Oh, she's gonna get hatched. Nice. Nice. GG, WP. Thank you for the save. Only one person's gonna see that, and the blight is current, or not currently, is a console player. They were playing with Starstruck, uh, Monster Shrine, Remember Me? Was I in the obsession? I didn't even notice. And Lightborn. That was a good match. Didn't pip, but I know why I didn't pip that match. I didn't do anything. I ran the killer the entire match, was caught twice, struggled, and had an amazing team who was not gonna leave me behind, even though I said leave me behind. <laughs> Even though I said they could leave me behind, I would have been happy with it, but that was awesome. Um, sadly, he resorted to camping and tunneling me, but I got free, so it all worked out. Uh, let's put in the envelope as our possibly last match. Possibly our last match. That was a quick match. That was a quick match. Oops, sorry. But GG's team. See, that's what I, uh, that's like the, some of the highlights I like about solo queue is like, I, I don't know if they're going to come back for me. I don't. Like, I don't really care if they do. If they don't, they don't. But I freaking love it when you get four randos. Now, maybe they were a Swift, who knows? You know, so they are communicating amongst each other. But you get some randos who actually want to come back and save you. It's like such a nice thing to see. Especially when you get a killer that just wants you out of the match. It's so fun to see. It makes me so excited. It makes me so excited when things like that happen in this game. You said 20 more matches? If I had to, if it takes me 20 more matches to take get one pip, I would do it. If it took me 20 more matches to get one more pip, I would do it. If I didn't have to eat dinner. <laughs> GG's to you as well. You is it Yunha music? Am I saying that correct? GG's to you as well. Thank you guys so much for being such amazing survivors. I was just saying that is what makes my solo queue experience worth it. That gets me so excited when I'm currently being tunneled and camped out of the match and the survivors just come through. They get them gens done, and they actually have time to save you at the same time. I don't know! I didn't do anything the entire match, honestly. I kind of ran him at the beginning. But not, like, very effectively. I could tell he was trying to do the rush action, so it's kind of like, you know, going in between a pallet and trying to get away from it. And that's about all I did. So I don't know, other than he just caught me first and wanted me out of the match. Sir, ma'am, who just popped this gen over here? I'll do it. <laughs> it's another blight, no! Not the same one, because different cosmetics, but. <laughs> I don't know why they've tunneled and camped me. I was looking for answers too. My only explanation was they are a little bit newer to Blight, and I was able to run them a little bit. But I'm not even that good of a runner, so I wouldn't even consider what I was doing effective. I was able to keep them away from me long enough for you guys to keep doing gens, so I don't know. I 
I juked him at the beginning and he dropped me, worked on some gens, and then I went for the save and noticed he was right there. And I was like, oh shit, I don't know if I can get this save solo. Team came through, so I just snuck up on him and was like, fuck it, save, right? You did awesome. I Like I said, I don't know why he decided to camp me other than I ran him for a while. But I freaking loved that the team came together and saved. I love to see it. Cause right at the end when he was camping me and Jens were done, I was like, y'all can go, I'm good. You know, if I die here, I die here. Maybe I'll give you guys some time to Sorry, I'll give you guys some time to open the doors and such. Did he not see me there? Oh, sorry. I'll heal you. And I know that feeling. I had a camper earlier who was an Oni. And I was the same way. I was like, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get the save on. I can't remember who it was now. Welcome and I was just hoping... Mom. Like, the team would come together and you could do some distractions and such. No, sorry, Nia, my bad! Ooh. I mean, I will admit... Ooh, spicy. Most of the match I was trying to get stuns in on him because, um, I have a challenge. I don't know if I'm able to finish this. Music, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on into Skelly Town. All right, I'll ban that. Missed me. <laughs> oh no, he ended up getting me. What the heck? I didn't even hear it. I didn't even hear him hit me. I thought he missed. There's a spicy totem over there, whoever wants it. But again, thank you so much for the saves, being an awesome teammate, and again, for the follow. Thank you, Bill. Like, I play solo queue. People hate on solo queue a lot, and I'm like, nah, it's fun. It's great. You meet some amazing people. And what gets me so freaking excited, I thought I saw something glowy. Blacks in solo queue is when you see people come together like that and actually get the save. It pumps me up for the next match. Let's go, whoever got that. Bill. Good job, Bill. Let me go use this. A second. I was waiting for that skill check to pop up that always pops up. Has been quite a few blights in the fog today, though. Blights and plague have been popular for me. I have not seen one Wesker. Yo! This might be my last match, and I might go an entire day without Daddy Wesker? Oh no. I hate it throwing that, but <laughs> hate throwing God Palette, but it was my last ditch effort. <laughs> no, I was gonna make it to the second one. <laughs> I wanted to get the. 
that second studded! It's okay. No worries, and GG. Good luck, have fun with the stream. Thank you. Same to you. Well, it's good luck and have fun in the fog. And thank you so much for being an awesome teammate. Here I am being tunneled again. All right, maybe he left. Give him the credit. credit. Maybe he left. Um, I saw a pallet out and I was gonna pick it up, but then I got distracted, so I don't know where he might have kicked it. I will admit I did miss my head on today. I've been playing with this build to try and get the stuns. It's not not helping, I'm just not getting killers who will get the stuns. Do you want heals? It is definitely helping me get there, and when I do get the hit, smash, smash it, is that what it's called? Does its job. <gasps> How could you? Hopefully he's being chased. He's being chased. Hopefully he's chasing someone. Yeah, I think he's chasing someone. I'm on death hook though, so no offense. I'm getting out of here. Damn, this gen is done. I don't want to go back doing this gen re and build we're working on because I, I kind of think that'll three gen us. I think I need to go not do that. I need to not fall in front of the blight is what I need to do. Mehmet. Oh no! He has sloppy! I didn't notice! Rip! I didn't notice! Cause there goes all my med kit, uh... Progress. He left me alone there after he hit me. I don't know if he did it because he knows I'm some second hook. I always appreciate that though when actually the killer does realize you're on your last hook. I mean, I'll do it. If I know they're on second hook and I'm starting to lose the match, I'll totally get them out of the match. Just try and turn it back in my fever. I am one of those kind of players.
Nice, Bill. Nice. No! I was just complimenting you on how good you were playing! No! <laughs> no! That's what you get for complimenting people. You compliment them and then they kill you. I was saying, oh, he's such a good killer. He's making sure everybody else has their hooks. Hoping he would hook Bill, then I could go free. Then he kills me. So what'd you get for complimenting him? <gasps> but I did! I pipped! <laughs> I pipped! Uh, hammer box seaweed. Uh, okay. Ah, oh, finally! Oh my gosh! I got uh, iridescent benevolent. Gold evader. Gold Lightbringer and only Silver Unbroken, but I freaking finally, it took me all day to get through Gold 3. And then right there at the end, we were doing just enough to not de-pip, but not enough to pip. So it's really good to last, we'll call that last match because that was actually a pretty good end to the stream. I mean, I died a little early. But I'm okay with how we died. It's not that big a deal. And I finally pipped. So that's all that matters. <laughs> I finally got my one pip I've been trying for like the last hour. So we'll call it there. Um, how many points did I end up with today? I know I spent some on Yoon and then I, or not Yoon, um, Fang. And then I also spent some on Rebecca earlier. Not bad, not bad. 600. And then I didn't finish my challenge, but we did finish the hatch. So that's okay. That one I feel like I probably won't finish unless I get either lucky or maybe a farming match. And then off stream I'll put some points into probably uh, not Hattie, Rebecca or Ada because they're the only two who are not prestiged up to three. So um, that'll be it for me today though. I, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done plague of the fog. <laughs> GG's! Thank you, finally! Finally, we got that last pip, and that's all I wanted. All I wanted was one more pimp. And we got it. And it wasn't like an overall bad day in the fog. It was your typical, you know, the right before Frank reset, you know, feels. I had more campers and tunnelers today than I have in a while, so. But it's okay, you know, when that happens, we'll just do this. Oh, I don't have it on the screen. Never mind. We, <laughs> we'll put out our marshmallows and our fire, and we'll have a good old time with the killer roast and s'mores with the camps. It's all good. Nothing to get mad about. Um, let me see if we could raid over to this person. I think they will be ending very soon, but I don't get to raid this person often, so I want to sneak over here. I'm ending a little earlier than I normally do. Because I do have to make dinner tonight. So let me grab this. Let me do this. All right. But that is it for me today. I will be back on Wednesday. Um, we will be playing more Dead by Daylight. The new tome will open. So we will be playing with that. Um, seeing what's in the rift and everything. And then just going about our day doing that. Um, so thank you guys so much for f hanging out and following. What are we up to? Oh, no. I don't know if I can find it real fast. 786! We're at 786 followers. I think y'all who followed and joined me today. But we are going to go share all the love to Taurus. I don't get to raid over to him very often because uh, time differences. He's usually ending about when I do. Uh, or he raids over here because I'm already still on. But we're going to go hop over there real quick before he does get off and say hello from Skelly Town. He is an amazing content creator. Currently playing Dead by Daylight. Did play the forest earlier because I was over there lurking around. But, if you guys would like to show all the love, please copy-paste the second raid command if you are a sub. If you are not, the first one works just the same and shows the same amount of love. And let's go give all of the love to Taurus for the evening. Give him a follow and give him all the love. He's an amazing, amazing person. Thank you all for hanging out with me today. I appreciate it. I hope you all have an absolutely amazing evening. And I shall see you guys on Wednesday for more DBD. And when the Tome and Rift opens. So thanks again, guys. Have a lovely evening. Bye-bye.